Everybody say guacamole. 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 Welcome once again, Not everybody. <laughs> Are we all excited? Yes. Definitely. Right. Painfully excited. Stop. Welcome once again, everybody here. Uh, this is, uh, well, this is not The Legends of the Undying. That will actually be, up, uh, we will actually be recording that in just a few hours from now here. But for yeah, right now. Hours. Shush. Exactly. <laughs> shush. Uh, this is, however, the second part of the Vault in the North. Uh, we are... This ragtag of uh, would-be thieves here trying to raid the Vault of the Claws. Um, if the DM would not mind me uh, going over this here, I'd like to give a brief free cap. Yeah, sure, go ahead. Okay. Uh, let's just go ahead and give this a brief free cap. We encountered the Vault, or rather, the, uh, the, the Keep of the Claws here, high in the frozen north. Uh, we were able to infiltrate here with uh, minimal uh, deaths uh, and many, many failed stabbings. Too, <laughs> many, too many failed stabbings. Um, but we were able to finally get into uh, the overall keep of the castle. Um by avoiding some of the patrols, we were able to make it to the stables. The uh, stable master, however, was uh, on to us thanks to uh, a nosy fucking Rudolph. I mean, seriously, why? Why would you? Why would you let those things anywhere outside of a uh, of a kennel? Uh, okay. <laughs> found ourselves a trap door. We were able to get inside the keep. We found some wonderful, wonderful stuff here. Stuff that most uh, humans would kill to get here, which, in fact, we did. Um, uh, yeah. Whatever these little gnomish elf thingies are. Um, and then we found ourselves the treasure vault. Which we are just about to raid. Uh, did I leave anything out here? Um, in the previous room, you did find uh, three notable items. One was uh, the Book of True Names. Mm -hmm. uh, you found Klaus's uh, sack, which was a giant uh, bag of hoarding, basically. Mm -hmm. And his personal uh, Klaus's cap the red poof ball hat yes um i don't know you, you guys wrote down what it does right yes we yeah. did have that written down right uh yeah you went through a corridor that uh, eventually led to the vault uh, you opened the door and fa just in time, Jitar found a trap with his heightened danger sense and managed to, to uh, disable it right as this here automaton turned around to face all of you. You just made the stealth track that you luckily, as a group, managed to beat and uh, he didn't spot anyone and that's where we left off. I don't know if you've not switched us yet, but I'm still in the main home screen. Right. Boom. Yes. There you are. And it was this uh, automaton that uh, turned okay. towards the door and uh, didn't spot you guys as it continued on working. Okay. We need to be stealthy, yeah. No, oh, then, uh, why am I here? Yeah, good question. In case we get hurt, yeah. Right. right. <laughs> We've been over this at least 40 times. How smart are you? 
Yeah. If Just you need to ask me, you should ask yourself. Now, Sleigh Bell, I, I, I don't vote know if any of you dead. mind. Yeah. I don't know if any of you mind, but I might need a couple minutes to myself. Oh, Warden, it's not a time for that. No. <laughs> I need some more. I need to regain some of my magic. I've spent. Sure, that's what all men say. Yeah. God he damn rolls it. Her eyes and goes like, <laughs> Not too <laughs> too. <clears throat> that was I need perfect. to find a voice again, because that's definitely not the voice. It's okay, take your time. But basically, um, if Warden could take two minutes to just consume a meditation crystal, if that's okay with everybody. Mm -hmm. So he mm -hmm. would initially heal himself, play on hands. All right, uh, Jithar, give me a, a sleight of hand to close the door without anyone noticing. Uh, slide of uh, hand, well, what does this area look like? Can he simply just sidestep away from the door, like around a corner in the hallway? If, if that's not so far away, that is. Who? Warden. Yeah, you could just take a few steps back. So that then he doesn't have to have everybody close the door, then open the door when he walks back. Well, still... the door right now is... Uh, I believe you opened it yeah, I did halfway open it here. or something, right? It was open. And this this here mecca did have the full, full view of the door. It just didn't spot you because you all stealthed. Mm -hmm. But the door was open. So you can take a few steps back, but the door is still open. Mm -hmm. So Jithar will definitely, if he needs to regain it for some, you know, use some crystals to regain his uh, magic ability, I can definitely close the door and I will roll you that sleight of hand. Okay. Yeah, because Warden could definitely use a couple more uses. Starting to sound like an addict. There we I'm go. I'm now a good person. Well, yeah, easy rolling. enough. The uh, the door closes without much of a creak. Hmm. And I'm hurry as quickly as possible. Yeah. yeah. And then he would step back and be like, I'm good. So, above game, um, what's our plan here? Are we just going to rush in, kill as many of these things as possible, and loot the damn place? Well, I was just here to kill things and steal everything, probably from you all as well. I wasn't here to make plans. That's we peaceful. We make plans. B puts like a hand on her chest as if to seem shocked while she looks at Slebo. Obviously acted. Then. B, have you ever seen these kind of automatons before? Um, I'm pretty sure you asked that. These are quite advanced. I haven't seen these kinds before. Okay, so you so... don't know how deadly they are. Other than, well... No, all she saw was that they were uh, weaponized, that she pointed out. But while the door was open, you can give me a perception check. Okay, okay, I'll do that. Um... Make sure to uh, turn off your uh, favorable terrain. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, I just click on the buff, yeah? Wait. Yeah. Uh, to the tick. And then I the tick left. the thing. Yeah, okay, okay, I did that. Uh, okay... Stop being a bubble. Okay. 
Perception. Here we go. A 14. Yeah, they definitely look like they uh, have some military upgrades. Hmm. Anyone Looks else like wanna look? Yes, they should. Uh, Warden pops up his visor, trying to get a look around. <laughs> He makes that noise himself because it's just a piece of metal. <laughs> yeah, you definitely uh, agree with Slaver. They they definitely look weaponized. I don't like them. <sighs> we, can we cut them out and just rob this place ourselves? Yeah. <laughs> hey, listen. When you're dying, you're gonna need me. We well, have if I die, <laughs> Go ahead. let me just finish that sentence some other time. We're wasting time. Yeah. B just leans in at uh, Jithar and just says, "All we have to do is outrun this lowest." He gives her a wink. <laughs> um, if. The that's our plan, or our overall plan here. Um, I believe I have a few th uh, abilities that allow me to, or at least one ability for sure, that allows me to full on, uh, yeah, fast stealth here. Let me put that in chat real quick here, because I need to read it. Uh, Allows me to move at full speed while using a stealth the stealth skill without a penalty here. Um, I want to yeah. start out from stealth and just attack the first thing that I can get. Yeah, fast stealth means normally when you stealth you move at half speed. Fast stealth just lets you move at full speed. Okay. Oh, that is not what I was trying to do. Damn it. Um, if Warda notices you're trying to stealth ahead and assassinate somebody, he'll cast Guidance on you. Okay. Uh, it's a plus one. Okay. Your next attack, saving throw, or skill check. You said it's... Uh... Alright, yeah, I can make it to this one right here. Uh, so, I'm just gonna run as fast as I can up this mound here, which... Uh, and then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, shank this this little what you call him. If I can. Uh, yeah. Do I need Sorry. to? Uh, uh, you you do need to uh, roll give stealth. me a stealth check because right now you're running in. You are in a dark corridor and you're running into a room that's pretty much lit up and just brilliantly light. Gotcha. Let me roll that. No, stuff you're not up. relying. You're not relying on shadows. You're literally relying on people not looking at you. Gotcha. I'm just waiting until the the right moment to dash out, basically. Uh, yeah. Basically, you definitely wait for the moment. These seem to be busy and making uh, their rounds and patrolling, and just as everything turns on a perfect moment, you run ahead with your fast stealth thing and manage to get right behind this one and give me an, a I will an attack roll please god damn it even with a uh, plus yeah. one i don't think that's gonna work a plus one uh for the guidance or was that only for checks ah uh, competency bonus for a single attack no roll. it's yeah. Attack or skill check, yeah. So whichever you he want gets to, to use choose. It yeah, I would have chosen it for that here, but even that would be uh, twelve then. Yes. Me Does see. He they are flat-footed because, um, yeah. So they are flat-footed. They don't know you're there. Okay, that's good. Which means you actually just hit him. 
with a 12. Son of a fucking bitch, that's great. So that means not only do I get the 8 piercing, I get the sneak attack. These things don't bleed, do they? Yep. So the moment you hit it, you know with the elf at the gate and the first elf you met. Um, they, you hit them so hard, they basically just evaporated. This one, you are met with a loud metal clunk and your piercing weapon does not do as much damage as you thought it would. Uh, moreover, it definitely doesn't seem like these things have uh, a lot of vital organs which you could just slice them through in a uh, coup de gras, as it were. Mm. Fuck. Me. Should have gone with a dagger. Uh, oh well. Um, check one little thing. But uh, would I be able to pull off the... Would that proc a debilitating injury? Uh, I would say you do get a sneak attack off from this. Okay. So let me go ahead and... However, oh. you know that when you twist your knife when you sneak attack, you usually can bleed the target. That doesn't seem to be working for this thing. Okay, so it would... So I would not debilitate them. Yeah, you do. You can debilitate them, but they they don't yeah. bleed. Oh, okay. I'm not. I'm not worried about the bleed. Um, I am gonna, however, <clears throat> have these guys bewildered. Ooh. Or at least this guy here. Right. And if anybody else wants to get off a surprise hit on these things here, you're more than welcome to. Would love to. Well, are we still surprising at this point? That's up to the DM. Uh, I would say, would you have followed him? If you would go in, yes. No. Warden would not have followed, knowing he's just going to cling clang everywhere. Yeah, that makes sense, but Slaybald wouldn't want to have him have all the honor. That's <laughs> because <laughs> she's got a bit of green in her, boys. Uh, I would say you get to move up to your speed. Because mm -hmm. in the surprise round, you basically can do either move or attack. And right now, he has surprised them, and the surprise round now starts. So you can either move or attack. I don't think you have a ranged weapon, so you can do move. Yeah, I, I will move. I'll, I'll go there. Actually, I'll go here. Right. And I think that means we can roll initiatives. Ooh! Can I re-roll my initiative? I don't think that's how that lets you. <laughs> no. <laughs> Yay! I rolled good on initiative for once. Nice. Right. Oh. Let's just do it like that. There we go. Um. Order. Right, this one does uh, turn around after uh, you all. Uh, well, after Jithar stabbed him. <laughs> yeah, stabbed it in the back. It seems uh, 
he he seems very small compared to you like smaller than a than a gnome even uh he looks up at you and you see his uh left eye the, the big one starts to uh turn a bright red as uh... you you are met with a laser in your face oh shit do i get a reaction to that does a 27 hit you well if you're gonna go ahead and hit me with a 27 i'd have to say yes <laughs> right, <give> me... <laughs> you are hit in the face for nine fire damage nine fire damage and... ah. You give me a reflex save. I will give you the reflex here. Um, here we go. Whoa! <laughs> nice! Right. Um, it's starting to burn at you, and it's uh, keeping its gaze on you for a little bit as it kind of tra trails over your armor, but you reflex away and, and dodge, and it seems like it was trying to uh, burn more of you, but wasn't able to. Whew. Well, that's good. Yes. Good news, everyone! Good Our news, it everyone! It alerted his uh, fellow units. Beep. Okay, I take the good news back. Yep. <laughs> this one... <laughs> Uh, moves ahead and hits you. Ow! What are you doing? Attempts to. Does a twenty-two hit you? It matches. Right, it's eight slashing. God, damn it! Eight slashing. Oh, he's not burning me. Okay. I'm in trouble. It uh, actually has has a scimitar, like, as as an arm. Well, it comes from his forearm. Snaps out. It slashes you with it. Uh, that's their turn. Jithar, your turn. <sighs> okay. So. Little tiny thing right there. Little tiny thing right here needs to die. And his little friend over here is next on my list. But let's start with the let's start with the big man here. I'm gonna kick his ass here. That's a twenty-two. Uh, debilitating strike. Uh, how long does it last? Uh, only one debilitation can be active at a time, and any form of healing ends the debilitation here. It uh, does not say how long it actually lasts for. Let me bring up the actual debilitating uh, injury here. Uh, for one round. Does it say one round? target takes a... Um... Does it say for one yeah. round? Um, yeah, it, yeah, for one starts. round. Penalty for one round. Yeah. So, uh, t twenty-two would definitely hit. He's uh, not being sneaked right now, so it's ten piercing. Again, you are stabbing at metal here, and it doesn't seem to do a whole lot of damage. Would I be able? No, oh, I can't do that at this time here. Um... I was gonna say, do I? Can I look for uh, for weaknesses here? But uh, I already, I already attacked him. Um. Hmm. I think I'm good at the moment where I am. But uh, nice. yeah, no, that's it. Warden. Okay, if anybody has taken five or more damage, or is wounded by five or more below their max health, you get five health. So that would be only Jathar, I believe. 
think so. Yes, thank you. Uh, then he is going to full action run or hmm. does double movement or a uh, what's it called? Um, words. Yeah, words, words. indeed. D I know full yeah, action words. run takes more full action. But I believe there's also, I can just um, do double movement, which is Yeah, you equal... can double move. It's the, it's the same as the dash. Which takes how much? It just takes... a straight action? Uh, no, double move is your movement, and then you use your standard action to move again. Okay. Um, he is going to do that to step right over hmm. here and he is going to clang his shield hoping to catch people's attention or you know the other robots attention so these three Instead of them going to them too. Uh, yeah, you definitely have their attention. Um, clang, 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 clang. You know, that'd be his turn. Right, this one over here. It goes to the clangy noise. <laughs> no good. And it will uh, attempt to slice you. Let's see if 21. This is... Nope. So far, so good. Right. This one over here. How far are you? He's far enough. Yep. You're clanking, you're clanking, you're hoping to draw this guy's attention as well. Uh, and has your attention, and as it looks at you, you see also a red eye glowing up. And before you know it, it shoots right at you. For a natural one, it deflects off your shield. <laughs> wow. Wow. Doing my job. Actually, give me a uh, D hundred, and okay. tell me high or low. Um, low, knowing me. Right. No, nope, should have <laughs> gone high. Yep. Should have double known uh, me, and know that I was gonna do the opposite. It shoots a laser at you, and you put your shoot just in time in front of you, and try to deflect it off on this guy, but you don't quite get the angle because it caught you by surprise. We skip geometry in school. <laughs> I think he skipped school, just period. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is why math is important, yeah. And now you tell him. For right. two years I've this been telling him, yeah. <laughs> runs over here. And... Ooh. ooh. I don't like that ooh. No. Ooh. Take it back. Slay bell. <laughs> No. You also see a red pointer on your uh, armor. You should look down, and then you look at this guy, and it's aiming at you. And I say, Warden, Warden! No, that misses. Right. <laughs> you say, what? what? And you pull Warden in front of you, and it deflects off his armor. <laughs> yes. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's what happened. <laughs> that is exactly what happened. It is now cannon. Oh god, this one runs over here and does nothing. Shit, I didn't it see looks that angry. Oh, that's good. Um, let me double check. You are intruders. Nope. You will be assimilated. Actually, it can move there, so. Uh, it sees its teammates swarming and will 
join the swarming. But nothing happens. Uh, sleigh bell. I would like to jump over here. Leap over there, I mean, with my leap ability. Um, okay. You will be moving through two threat zones, so that's... Now I jump over them. He's gonna, she's going to use me as a jumping post, I guess. Well, uh, okay, I'll say you can leap over this one, but you're leaving this one's threat zone. Yeah, yeah that makes sense. That makes sense. Uh, so you can give me a uh, acrobatics to leap, which is just a DC 15. Okay. Easy. <laughs> and another acro to avoid his attack of opportunity. If, or you can uh, choose to jump the gun on that one. Not be acrobatic and just uh, risk taking the hit. The difference is, if you risk taking the hit, he might hit you. If you fail the acro, you lose your movement. Oh. Well, can I swap my acro and, and my crit and my uh, <laughs> thing around? <laughs> I think we both have uh, the answer to that. I... Uh, yeah, I, I clicked that before before I listened yeah. to you. So. Yeah. So would you have attempted to avoid it, or would you just have risked taking the hit? Your just risk taking the hit, I guess, yeah. Ooh. Uh, yeah. Okay, he does a swing. Ooh, 25. Okay, do, I have a question. Do I still land here? Yeah, 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 because you didn't take the acro, you still get your movement, you just take the hit. So, okay, as okay. you leap away, you take six slashing damage. Okay. Uh, minus six. Okay. So, I did something extremely annoying to myself. I have to keep count of all of this. You have no one to blame but yourself. It's very true. I'll take it out on you guys. <laughs> and he went, then he went, then he went. Yeah. Then he went. All right. Uh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, continue. Uh, but didn't I lose my turn? Uh, I don't no. think he hit. You, you leaped. He hit you. You moved. Continue with your other Oh, I thought I lost it because he hit me. No, that's if you attempt to acro do fancy footwork to not get hit. And then if, still get hit. You know, yeah, if you oh, fail okay, the fancy okay. footwork... You just stop moving because you failed. If okay, you sorry, don't Mr. attempt to be fancy, you just move and risk the hit, you get hit, but you still get the rest of your movement and your turn. Okay, then I will go and attack. Um, this one between us, please. Right. It's too much. Uh, that's you gave a... her this ability. It's your, it's your fault. Uh, it's 22 to hit, because it's a minus 1 plus 2 for flanking. Uh, you definitely hit with... God damn it, all of them. <laughs> Even the third one, because of how Jithar's positions, you managed to just flank perfectly. And... You get your entire flurry off. But you also notice that you're you're hitting metal. It's not doing a whole lot of damage, as much as you wish. I'm hitting metal, and it isn't doing as much damage as I wish it would. If anybody got a hammer? Could be useful. Aren't you the brute here? Okay. 
I am the hammer. Yeah, that's my time. Right. Uh, moving on then. Top of the round. It's the wrong way around. Uh, this one. It will attempt to. Uh, it takes a five foot step over here and goes to hit Jithar. Damn! That definitely hits for seven slashing damage. It hit? Where did it? Oh, I'm curious what it hit. Or, uh, I'm curious how, uh, what it rolled here, but you said seven? Yeah, seven slashing. Uh, well, it, it hit, uh, hit a 30. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm... Well. Oof. Well, yeah. No, definitely. This one. Takes advantage of the flanking. Uh, is it 22 hit you? Me? God damn it. Yeah, that hits. That's nine. Why you do this, DM? Stop hitting me, damn it. <laughs> Stop hitting me. <laughs> uh, that's their turn, Jithar. Fuck it. This one that's uh, flanking me, I'm... Wait, this one moved, didn't he? Yes, he did. So he did a five foot step, yeah. Yeah. This one and this one, I can probably take advantage of flanking for. Yeah, you know you're what? flanking with both of them. Yeah. So I'll tell you what, this one looks like he probably does. That one look like he took a little bit more damage. Uh, they seem to be perfectly evenly <laughs> taking okay. damage. I'll tell you what. If this, uh, let me know if this takes my whole turn, but I want to see if I can observe these things here and see if I can find a weakness that we can exploit. Mm. What would I need? Do I need um, to roll something for that? You would need to roll, um, basically our Kena, uh, only if you're trained in it. Fuck, I am not trained in it. If you're not trained in it, the highest you can roll is like a 10, and that would just give you superficial information. Well, uh, before attacking the one that's uh, closest to Sleigh Bell here, um, he will um, call out to the others and say, "Look for weaknesses, nya." And um, okay. I'm gonna stab this little ba this little bastard if I can. If roll twenty will actually do it. God damn it! That Thirteen. Nope. It's I don't think 15. that hits. What? It's just a fifteen, right? With flanking. Uh, oh yeah, just a 15, yeah. Uh, 15 just misses. Yeah, I had a feeling. Just. Fuck. No All right. they'll keep wailing on ya. Do you have any other actions? I have other actions, but I don't know if I really want to pursue moving at this point in time here. Even if it was just a five-foot step, uh, it's it's not. Ad I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm not very. I'm not in a very advantageous position at all. Um, I'll I'll stick. I'll stay right where I'm at for now. All right. If I see that I'm in in danger, I'll move. Uh, Warden. Okay. Um. This changes things. Warden is going to step up this way five foot step 
And then, considering Jathar is there, he is going to full action total defense. And that's his turn. And upon his turn, everybody also heals by five. That took five or more damage. Right. right. I will also put this on your screens to remind you there are other combat maneuvers you could do. Let's see here. Mm -hmm. Okay, that could be a good one. Crap, I accidentally. Let me run back into the game. <laughs> Did you X the game? I accidentally hit um, the side buttons, which takes me back a page. Because mm. I did that to go back on the page I'd opened, and I remember I could just slide it aside. Yeah. Um, yeah. So actually, everything needs to load back again. Um. In that case, what I might end up doing instead is, while I'm here, I'm going to drag this guy. Which one? Uh, the guy that's between me and Jathar. Okay. Um, instead of moving with him, can I just move him behind me? Instead of dragging him with me? Uh, that would be a reposition. Oh, is it? Okay. Okay. Um, okay. That's what he's going to try to do then. Uh, sure. Roll me CMB. Okay. Eighteen versus there. Oh no! That you grab him and try to like join him like around you, but he digs his heels into the gold, and I don't know if he magnetized or something, but he's not budging. Then in that case, he is just gonna step up here because that uh, took his standard action. Yeah, I will say the moment you grab him and try to uh, yoink him, moving him around, uh, he will take that opportunity to attempt to hit yeah. you for 22. Uh, let me find out. Let me remove the buff. Uh, 22, no. All right. Um, so he's going to five foot step up there. And that took his standard action, so... Uh, Jathar, did you heal by five? Give me a second. But I will in just a second. Yep, yep. And... Does he have anything else he can do? He is... This also takes a standard action. Um, he's just gonna cling his shield again, and he's gonna stand there. Uh, sure. You mean intimidate? Okay. Twelve. Uh, Versus there. Fifteen. No, they do not seem extremely interested in your clanging. They are well. automatons and they are just focusing on their targets right now like animals who would get distracted. And that's his turn. Right. This one. This one now also has a uh, red dot on your person. And loads it up as it shoots. 20. On who? On you. Uh, no. Right. We'll move up over here. This 
peaceful no five foot step over here. He's getting awfully crowded, nya. <laughs> then move and let me take the front. Oh my god. Stop rolling low! Please keep rolling low. <laughs> Please keep lo rolling low. Thank you, roll 20. <laughs> This one rushes at you. Charges at you. We are the oh! Does a 32 hit you? Just barely. Alright, finally something hit you! 15 <laughs> slashing damage. Out. Go. Yeah, he critted. <laughs> Ouch. You have 15. Gotcha. And lastly, this one. Um, yeah, they're just going to close the gap and charge at Jithar. Damn it! I see that this t heap of metal is very hard to hit, so they're gonna take out what they can take out. 17 hit you. Hit me? No, wait, that's, that's 19. 19? Yeah, just... They're trying to hit me? Nah, they don't hit me. Right. Swings at you and just, at that point, a few coins displays and it just misses. Not it's even. so good you took that buckler for that extra plus one. I know, right? <laughs> uh, sleigh bell. Okay, so I have a question. How much nut pain did it seem I was doing? It's not a one of you trained in Arcana? No, but oh. I, I have been killing people for a long time, usually, you know, it hurts <laughs> a lot. So, when I look at this thing, does it mean, like, I might be doing, like, half as much pain as about usual? About half. But about half as much pain, okay. Not, not thinking that's cool at all. But very little that I can do. Um... Yeah, so uh, I I I'm gonna keep attacking this one because I don't know what else to do. Uh, I think with my daggers. Wakizashi. Yeah. Right. Well, well you have a plus you think three. Very well. Yes. Because you're flanking, so all of that hits. <sighs> Let's see, um... Is it... Uh, uh, as I'm hitting them, and I'm, I'm, I'm like hit, learning my hits, and I am thinking about this, does it look like... Because they're machines, does it look like... Uh, as I'm trying to hit it in different spots, can I do some kind of check to discover if there was a particular spot that hit better oh, than sorry. others, like maybe something where the wiring is, something like that. Um, sorry about that. In the middle of combat, it's very hard because everything happens in like six seconds and you're just acting on instinct and muscle memory right now. Okay. Um, however, you do manage to land a crit. Yeah. Uh, in the last one, and I'll say if you spent a uh, uh, a whole standard action on just one hit on these things now, yeah, uh, you get a guaranteed crit. But you can only swing once if you do that. Yeah. That's okay. Action. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> 
and lastly that's 19 reduced to less it seems you can hear it whirring it seems hmm. to almost break down can everyone else work as hard as me thank you I'm trying <laughs> that's my thing <laughs> These things just don't want to die. We have to fix that. Right. This one. Sorry, a little bit of a lot. Alexandros came into that one. I apologize. <laughs> <laughs> what will it do? What will it do? I don't know. Surrender. Yeah, surrender. That they're, seems like the best course of action. They are clearly it. outclassed. Obviously. It will attack uh, uh, Jithar. Damn it. For a whole last 18. <laughs> no, I sidestepped that. But please stop rolling under a 9. Keep rolling under 9. Thank you. Yeah, I'm, good. I'm fine with that. Raise roll I'm 20. Good. Uh, this one is almost dead. Doesn't like what's happening. It will actually turn around to Slaybo, who is its biggest uh, threat right now, and laser her. Oh, okay. okay. I'm gonna say he did it. Uh, it seems to focus a bright laser right at you. Uh, the monkey said, he did it. Uh, it doesn't confirm the crit. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, you take I a slow nod, like, yeah. <laughs> Level <of> fire damage. <laughs> 11, okay. Ah! And give me a reflex save. A reflex save, okay. Um... Wait, how do I do reflex Breath. save? For that? Under touch. Oh, wait. Just click rough. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I just clicked the button. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. Eleven. Oof. Uh, normally, when you get hit by something, it just hits you and you move on. This thing just keeps its laser on you for like a few seconds longer, and as it happens, your armor starts to catch on fire just from the sheer heat of the laser, ah! and you take five more fire damage as you catch on fire. Usually, I'm a kind of thing, hot, but it's not. Oh. Okay. Minus five. I know it's not very fun, yeah. I'm starting to pat myself. <laughs> yeah, it takes a full round action to put out your flames. Okay. Or water. Um, other than that, you will take 1d6 at the start of every round. Oh, uh, yeah, we're not doing that. Uh, Jithar, your turn. Yay! Yay, we're gonna kill some things here. The guy that doesn't look too happy here. He's the one that's kind of looking nearly dead, right? Yeah. Um, I just realized something here. These little mechs here, they are essentially devices, right? I wouldn't say they're devices, they're constructs. Damn it. I was gonna say I could probably I, if they if we considered them devices I could use disable device on them, but if they're constructs, it's a whole different story altogether here. So for the weakest boy right there, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'm just gonna put him out of my, um, our misery here. Um. Sorry. You can you can look at if you look at this, you think you might be able to disable device it, but this is extremely advanced. You I'm not will looking probably to... need some time and definitely not be surrounded by four of them. Well, more specifically, I'm just looking for an effective way to break it, not turn it off. You know what I mean? Mm. Uh, 
not directly now. Then we're going to go with the good old-fashioned way and just hit it with a uh, sharp and pointy stick. Um, for, for 29. 11 plus 7. Damage. Mm -hmm. Right, this thing stops functioning as it reaches zero hit points. At which Ooh. point... Oh, no. Yeah. If this and thing goes boom. It will self destruct. Yeah. No, but I killed it! I'm going to have Slaybell roll me a d2. Oh, why me? That is my fault. Okay. A one, it hit, it yeah. will go explode towards Dither, and a two, it will explode towards Slaybell. Roll a three. No! <laughs> it explodes I didn't deserve Slaybell. this. <laughs> I'm just happy it didn't explode give towards me. me. A re give me a reflex save. No. Okay, a reflex save. But I'm already on fire. This is uh, why I like the evasion feat here. Nice. 18. Ooh, nice. So. As this thing explodes, you take one slashing damage. Um, nice. And only three fire damage. Okay. I give Jitara that stare. <laughs> uh, Wasn't mean, Yan. At the corn at the at your peripheral vision as you give Jitar a death stare, you do notice that some of the coins that were in this heap where it was standing are now molted together. Not sure if it's worth more or less now. Gold is still gold, Nyan. Either way, it's not coming out of my cut. <laughs> Just a clump now. Um Right. Well, you would have added like me explode in that nyan. Sorry. Uh, but yeah, um, now that I've got a little bit more room to breathe here, I think I will take a... Would I be able to make a, a five-foot step here? I just want to move right here. Uh, you haven't used your movement, so you can take a full movement if you want. But it will take you three acrobatic rolls to avoid any attacks of opportunity unless you want to take it. Five oh. foot step means no attacks of opportunity if you want. Yeah, it's or you can just five. move five foot. I would yeah. just move five feet and again just right here is where I want to go. Zad, sure. I want to be continue to flank some enemies here while keeping him at the forefront of all the attention of those bots over there. <laughs> And I think that's my turn. All right, Warden. Everybody heals by five. Woo! Warden, uh, this is gonna attack. Actually, he is going to defensively attack the this one. I think that one's been hit, or it's either been this one that's also been hit. Okay, you guys one. see the HP now? Yes. Yes. Okay. So I'm going to go on the bottom one. He's going to defensively attack that guy. Uh, let me turn it on. And then... 16. 18 with flanking. 18 with flanking will definitely hit it. Okay. Um... You feel that the slashing damage you do isn't so much, but cold damage seems to go through just fine. Okay. And then he is going to swift action lay on hands himself. Is Does that provoke attack of opportunities? I believe so. It's why I did fight defensively. Right. Uh, right. I think that one didn't got its turn already. Yeah, 
you'll get four attacks. Okay. Nope. Nope. Uh, twenty-four. Nope. Uh, ooh, thirty-one. Yes. Okay. Well, it doesn't confirm the crit. But unless does twenty-five hit you? Nope. Okay, eight damage. Okay. Um. And then that's his turn. His clock works. Isn't that bad? Uh oh. Hmm? What happened? No, nothing, nothing. Uh, this one will attempt to, uh, what was gonna do to you? Oh, I'll just attempt to laser you. Who? Warden, I assume? Uh, yeah, this is a two warden, yeah. Also, okay. I just remember this is a touch AC, not your flat AC. That's my bad. There's a 20 oh, hit no. your touch AC. Yes. He's sure it's not normal AC? Or maybe it's just a... flat footed AC? <laughs> it's a laser. That definitely means normal AC. Right. Uh, 20 hits. Um, eight fire, and give oh. me a reflex save. She. Oh. That's pretty bad. Reflex save. Oh. Yes, it is. You. Ooh. You feel your armor starting to heat up as it keeps its laser focused on you for just that little bit longer. But you go like, stop! Push it in, in the face, and it stops. <laughs> you just made that. With a 14? Yep. It's not a very high DC. Yes! Okay. Uh, so you don't catch on fire. Okay. And uh, to make up for how this narratively works, let's just say that they uh, upgraded during combat they learned. <laughs> Of course. Clever girl. This one will attack after it moves five feet. Twenty-five. Son of a God damn it, That's yes, it hits. Eight slashing. Eight, you say. Eight it shall be. This one will also slash at Warden for 20. Nope. <laughs> uh, lastly, this one will slash 24. Warden? Yeah. Nope. He's got a high one. Oh, yeah. I forgot they all get plus 10 to hit Warden now. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Warden also gets plus 10 AC, right? That's about <laughs> Uh Yeah, they seem to be just... Their height is at disadvantage against this metal giant. Uh, they're just hitting... Freaking... Pillar. They're hitting a wall, basically. <laughs> pillar of metal. Yeah, uh, that's their turn, Slabo. I am going to empty a flask of water over myself. Hello? You're going to wipe right. yourself? Yeah, empty the flask of water that you have. Oh. Yeah. Uh, sure, I will say that will take you an action, though. Yeah, that's fine. Um, and then... Do I still have my movement, if I do that? Uh, if you use the water, yes, you still have your movement. Okay, then I'm going to move over here. And that's my that's my turn. 
how exactly? Am I considered you... wet? Okay, draw it. Wait, wait, let me just count my movement here. Yeah, I can make that. Yeah, um, as you enter here, it's threat zone. You move oh, within that's... a threat space. Oh, so okay, so can I then end up here? Sure. Okay. Um, am I considered wet? Uh, sure. Okay. That's my turn. Because I want to empty my whole flask of him myself. Yeah. We, you would have to, pretty much. Yeah, okay. That's my turn. Okay. Um, so, this one goes. Jithar, roll me a d2. Ah, oh, fuck. Alright. You got it. It says it's rolling. One. Oh, that's very unfortunate for me. It turns to face Warden. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, does a twenty-seven? No, just it's a nineteen. It misses. Uh, fantastic. Just are your turn. Yeah. Let's see here. <laughs> I'm looking at the, a lot of the combat and conditions that we can have here. Um. Give me a second. I'm actually kind of curious here. Actually, I'm kind of curious here. Would it be possible no, I'm not going to worry about that. Although it's something to consider for the next round here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and unload on this one here. I know I'm not going to get too many uh, boosts to it here, but at the very least, I want to go ahead and stop with the whole, you know, flanking me shit. Damn it. Something tells me that doesn't hit. Uh, who? Uh, him. Would you? Oh, no, that doesn't hit. Yeah, I had a feeling. So, um... Yeah! I don't like this guy. Uh... But, if, uh... If I can, I'm gonna go ahead and just move right here. See if we can't murder sandwich him. And that's, uh, that's all I'm going to do. Right. I want everyone to give me a perception check. Okay. Fucking hell. Slaybo, you hear something rushing behind you. But you look and there's nothing there. I'm wearing Santa's hat. Do I still not see anything? Yeah. I have a big I question. I swear there's something behind me, but I don't see anything. Warden! Okay. Um. Warden's turn. He is going to. Swift. A four-round action means no swift actions, yes? Or no? Uh, swift action and immediate action are uh, exceptions to four-round. You can still do them. However, I do have to remind Slaybo, you take 1d6 at the start of your turn before you put out the fire. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, let me roll that. Okay. I'll give you my roll, which is a one. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. 
sorry, carry on. Uh, you can still take a swift action after or okay. during a full round action. So he is going to total defense, full round action, and then lay on hands himself. That's a swift. And then once again, everybody does heal by five points. Which means Warden just healed by one point. Since it's gone full round, they get their attack of opportunities again. Fuck me. That's a miss. That's a miss. Does a 29 hit you? Nope. Jesus. Holy fuck. This Man, is why you take me. the proper steps. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Well All done. of them see you take a moment to just heal yourself as a warm glow emits from your hand. And all of them are... <laughs> ding, 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 ding. <laughs> <laughs> ding, 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 I turtle up and this glow comes from beneath my armor. Pretty much. Look at us doing all the work. Warden is just standing there doing nothing. You <laughs> want to fix which places? Go ahead. I gotta get my armor fixed after this. In all honesty, I think we're doing most of the work That's here. That's his trail. <laughs> then, let's see if the little... Let's see what the little uh, mechanized oh, menaces do. Um, actually, upon his turn, I have forgotten. Um, da, 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 da. He is going to... What does this take? Uh, move action. Is that something he can do uh, even though he did a full round action? No, a full round action takes up your standard and your move action. Dang it. So but he you can't use five of Right? You could five foot step still, yes. Because he wanted to use boots of earth. Uh, no. It's your move act, whether it was movement yeah. or just the action itself. Okay. So then, never mind then. Right. The rest of these elves. elves. I mean. Uh, hmm. Okay. This one looks at Slay Bell again. And uh, you again see a stupid red dot on your armor. Oh, not this again. Uh, as you say that, it, it shoots the beam up and you just... F flexibly avoid it with a 13 to hit. Neo bullet dodge. <laughs> It's not even a Neo yeah, Blue she just uh, this again, and she just doesn't get it. Just, like, I little... opened up my sword, I reflected it. <laughs> Give me a dexterity check. Flat dexterity. dexterity. Flat dexterity. Uh, that's this. Nine. Oof. Actually, let's make that reflex. So put your reflex modifier on top of that. Oh, uh, what's my reflex? Reflex is plus nine. Plus so it's a plus five? Because her dex is three. Plus three. Yeah. So, so plus nine minus three is plus six. Because of 15. Yeah. 15. Oh. Just grazes its head as it misses. You almost deflected it. Ooh, cool. That would have been so cool. Look, Jethar, this is a cool trick, but if you aim it at me, I'll kill you after. 
Uh, right, sorry. Uh, this one goes to... Goes to... Uh, well, every round it seems to... Uh, somehow, this giant has been hurting for some reason. So, clearly, whatever they're doing is working. <laughs> so, I they're mean, not that's learning. A, that's a logical thought process. Uh, that's a 24 to hit, Warden. Nope. Right. Just say ow, so they think they're hurting you. Ow. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, ah, uh, that hurts. Ow. <laughs> Stop. This one goes in overdrive. <laughs> and puts a, a red dot right at the back of you and tries to shoot you for a 29. Oh, touch AC. No. Oh. Touch AC! Uh, I gotta find that out. Let me let me take a look. Uh, yeah, that that definitely hits with twenty nine. Hey, dang it! Well, you take ten fire. Oh, then if you would clean armor. your armor, then that would have reflected. <laughs> ten fire armor and ten fire damage and what? Yeah, as your armor heats up. Uh, and give me a reflex save. Nice! Very nice. That's a 19 under roll. You feel that sting behind you as your armor heats up and you just turn so it doesn't keep focusing on one position and then the laser uh, ends. And you don't catch on fire. Okay. Lastly, this one will hit you for... A thirty-one hit you. Yes. It crit that confirms. <laughs> you take no. four flashing. Fifteen. Yeah, it critted. Okay, one five. Because I thought you said fifty. I was like, fuck. I also have a question. 50. Was taking a potion is that a, a, an action or bonus mm. action? It's in the. It's a move action. Move yeah. Okay. Yeah, because it represents you actually having to grab it. Okay, okay, makes sense. You do get attack for opportunities, remember that. Oh, okay. Yeah, normally it's a an action, but it it's just no fun if you have to spend your entire action just drinking. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No, I agree. Uh, <clears throat> this one already attacked, right? Yeah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. So okay. So I have a question, and I, when I've been looking at these, and they've been wailing a little bit, does it look more like it's steam powered or electrical powered? Or what does it seem like? It might be, you know, running on magic. Oh, hence that's the, so stupid. Hence the Arcana <laughs> check earlier. <laughs> <laughs> Um, when I look around me, where's B? You don't see B. B! Quit I'm calling out down the hall. Yeah. If I'm not getting paid at the end of this, okay. I'm going to be so I mean, angry. Last, last time you saw her was around this, this position, and you guys all rushed in. And from here, you, you don't see B directly. Okay. When I yell out, does she reply? Uh, no. Then again, she hasn't been very known so far to be very vocal. Okay. Well, I just hope she's alive. Uh. Okay. So, I. I would like to. Actually, do something. Um. Well, obviously, I would like to do something. Um, uh, do it. I want. I want to. I want to cast grease on this thing, like right in its laser hole. Okay. Uh, does have to do. Oh, I should just cast the thing, right? It needs to do a deck save or fall if it moves. So I think. Let me see. 
It covers a surface, and the creature in the area must make a... Yeah. So, to his... where he's standing? Yeah, it's a 10 feet square, so... Oh, it's a 10 feet... you know what, I'm not doing that. <laughs> I don't want to uh, subtract my party to this. Uh, I'm sorry, I was making a mistake. That was, uh, I totally just wanted to attack it. Uh, if it's <laughs> a, something that requires a reflex save, I can generally evade it. Yeah. True. Um, I'm flanking. Uh, uh, yeah, did you want to, to do my final... Yeah, no, no, I'm just going to attack it four times because that will let me more than a crit. Right, and did you want to do like a single for for a crit or did you want to just... No, I'm going to do all four crit. because that will do me more damage than, than one crit right. if I hit. Um, but I, I was going to ask something that I already forgot. Oh yeah, I've hit this one before, so the first one also doesn't have a D minus one, it just has a 17 plus three. Uh, I don't think you've hit this one. Oh no, you're right. I just stepped in this zone. Uh, but so okay. So this first one yeah, is uh, 16, 19. Three, yeah. Uh, that still hit easily. Oh okay. That's... Bang, 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 bang. Ten, eighteen. Plus 7 is 25, plus 10 is 35. Oof. Reduce to... No, no reduction, Bunched. no reductions. <laughs> you know, on our 5 foot step here. Alright. Yeah. Oh, uh, that's my turn. Everyone give me another perception check. Oh god. Okay. <sighs> Something's coming. This is not good. Need to get rid of these faster. Come on, roll 20. Well, I'm doing my job. Woohoo! Nice. Oh, a 30. That's nice. I have seen into the ether. And I know what is coming. The great old ones. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> um, Jithar yes. always sees it. As you're looking around, uh, kind of on instinct, also because a sleigh bell just called out for uh, B and she hasn't been around, you can just do a quick glance and I should pass over here. Where am I passing over? Uh, yeah, pass a glance over there. You do see her standing there. Uh, the girl. only reason yeah. she does have a, a bit of a shimmer around her. The only reason you see her is because she rolled natural 20. <laughs> I literally did see into the ether. Lovely. Pretty much. Uh, what, uh, as you look at it, you see that she's just collecting coins, putting it in the bag. Clever girl. <laughs> Excuse me, what you're babbling about? Don't worry about it, Nyan. Okay, top of the round. This one. Uh, has its laser back. So, bring it on, you pile of scrap. You may intimidate. <laughs> oh no. Whoo wee. Here we go. Do high. Roll high. God damn it. Uh, okay. uh, it's because you forgot to praise one. roll 20. You can roll me a d3, uh, Warden. Okay. Oh, forgot to praise roll 20. Three. Oh my god. Um. <laughs> it will have a, another laser starts uh, the red glow in its eyes starts uh, booting up 
and you see it's starting to uh, get brighter, and then it turns around. Oh no! Oh, he did that sleep. <laughs> oh no! Oh. Is it twenty-one touch AC hit you? No. I'm lying. Right. <laughs> you take five fire damage. And, and give me a reflex. Do I get reduced damage because I'm wet? Correction, you're now dry. <laughs> you take two fire damage. Ooh. And give me a reflex. Yes. Actually, you're too, uh, too wet. Uh, you don't catch on fire. Ooh. That's its turn. Jithar. Yeah. I see that one turn around to Sleigh Bell. I'm not too keen on it doing that. I'm out of curiosity. Would it be possible to sunder that weapon? Um, Which one? The eye. His eye. Um, yeah. If you can hit it. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm guessing that's a CMD. It's roll? just a straight up attack. Straight up attack. Straight up attack. Okay. But you're aiming exactly I'm for the eye. Aiming with my rapier right at its fucking eye. That is a 22. Nice. Yeah. 22 hits. However, how much is that? You're not flanking. Yeah, no. Unfortunately, you hit it straight. It seems to be too protected for 9 damage. Mm. It's too hard. Mm. Yeah, and uh, since it's not... For, com for since... comparison's sake, for people uh, playing, it's a bit like um, the Ultros. It has a hardness. Uh, okay. That's fine. That's fine. So, basically, I would have had to have crit on the damage, then. Okay. I have a technical question, then. If I were to hit it, like, several times, would the damage, like, add up, or is it individual per hit? Individual. Okay, okay. Well, now that it's turned around, so, I don't want to move. So exactly like the ultra step. Mm -hmm. Now that it's turned around, I almost don't want to move here, but I think I will. I'm going to go ahead and move to flank with, uh, I'm going to do, I basically just do the five foot step here to flank with, uh, with Sleigh Bell. All right. Uh, Warden. Everybody heals by five. Thank Warden you. is going to stand up from his turtle position. And he is going to defensively attack with his shield the um This one? Yep, yeah, that one. Uh definitely hits. Okay. And then he is going to uh, we do notice that Wow, you think that was a solid hit. It impacted minimally. Jeez. These, things, these things are sturdily built. He is also going to um, swift action lay on hands himself. Right. Uh, that's going to take attack of opportunities again. 25. Uh, that... No. Why? Because warding. And another 25. No. Okay. <laughs> All four miss. Okay. Um, he is then going to move action, plant his feet for um, Boots of the Earth. Oh, okay. 
become unmoving. What does it do? Um, so Boots of the Earth gives him, when he plants his feet, he can't move. If he moves, it loses the bonuses. But it gives him a fast healing of one, which means every round he gets one point of health. Okay. And he also gets a plus uh, four bonus to CMD. Okay. I will say Boots of the Earth draw strength from the Earth, and you're now right now standing on a heap of gold about 10 feet above the Earth. Fuck me. But oh. they are mined from the Earth. I mean, they are literally <laughs> made of marble, so... Yeah. Uh-huh. Um, well, in that case, instead of a sweat, instead of a, a move action for that, he'll move action for a healing potion. Alright. You can also just move. They just all got their attack of opportunities. That's true. Is this actually Earth? Yeah. Okay. If he stands here, will he then be in contact with the Earth? But if I move, then I still lose my move action, though. That's the thing. Yes, you would. Yeah, but so he's just turn, you will be able to. Yeah, okay, you can drink a potion. Yeah, so potion up. I think you guys got few last time. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we got a we got a few. Okay, that's his turn. How many you got? About a few. Uh, these. This one will. What's he gonna move do? Move over. Five feet. We'll run away from Slaybell. Oh dear. Does that give me? Oh no, that's just sort of a disengage. Okay. Yeah, just five feet. Yeah. And uh, it's going to hold its action. No. No, it shouldn't do that. Well, that's the wrong button. Uh, this one will run straight down and provoke an attack of opportunity from Warden. Uh, okay. So he is fighting defensively, so that is going to be... Oh, why? Did you go full? No, you were fighting defensively. Yeah. Uh, 10 misses. Uh, this one charges straight at Jethar. Four. Seven slashing. He charges. Oh, dear. Well, I'm guessing... Yeah. He... Oh, okay. 20. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 31 to hit. So, that is... Uh, that was seven, you said? Yes. Alright, making sure I heard right. Here we go. The moment <sighs> this one sees its buddy flank, it releases its held action mm. for 30 to hit, 6 slashing. Fucking hell. I hate being in a tight spot like this. <laughs> Can't imagine. Um, this one will hold its action. This one takes a five foot step and hit Warden for ooh, a 32. Yeah. It doesn't confirm the crit though, so it's just eight slashing. There goes the eight HP you just got. Yep. I rolled and so low on that healing potion, too. <laughs> yeah. This one releases its health action. It's at oh. So that's a 28 to hit. Yep. Six slashing. And that's all of their turns. Sleigh Bell. Okay, we need to really kill these quickly. This one seems deader than all the other ones. So I'm going to five foot step over here and I'm going to attack it. 
You're flanking, right? Yeah. Um. All but the second hit. Okay. So that's uh, 11, 22, plus 7 is 29. It seems to be whirring like this one did. Sliver of grease left in its cogs. <laughs> Oh, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna say, before you finish that off, let me run away. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's my turn. Right. Oh, boy. Yeah. Uh, this one's turn. Yeah. I do believe it we are fucked. Well, stab itself. <laughs> yeah, sure. I'm sorry, what? It's the Puku. He disappointed its master. Yeah, oh. it just survived for so long, and then this intruder comes and flourishes it half to death. So it turns around and it attempts to hit you for 18. No. Nothing but air. <laughs> Jithar. Yeah, I'm I'm in a tight spot here. So I don't like this. You can't you can withdraw, uh, aka disengage. Yeah. I'm I was actually going through some of the the rules right now here about that. So that being said here. I hate doing that here, but that takes up my my whole uh, my whole round action if I withdraw, right? Um, just to be, I'm just trying to be clear on that. Let me double check that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's a four-round action. I had a feeling. Okay. Well, I need to get, I need to get clear a bit here. So I will go ahead and uh, I go ahead and withdraw, and essentially just move my uh, full speed here over here. Uh, I will say uh, withdrawing only Half makes your first first square save. Any consecutive squares still provoke attack of opportunities. It's just your originating square that's safe. So I would suggest you take like a little detour okay. here. Then I'll move there. So you only take one attack of opportunity from this one rather than from both. All right. Actually, I suggest going here because this one used its attack of opportunity to attack Warden. Okay. Um, I will follow your suggestion. Yeah. So just move and then... Uh, you can move up to double your movement when you withdraw. So from there, and then... That's five. I do want to get just a little bit of... Uh... Of room away from these guys here. Not uh, not gonna be leaving entirely the battle. Just get some breathing room here. I'm not the tank. <laughs> True. And I guess that's it. Uh, that's all I can do right now. Yeah. No swift actions or anything. Um, I don't believe so here. Most of the stuff that I have here kind of just requires actions at this point. You know, or you know, right. standard actions. 
Warden. Um, everybody heals by five. Warden takes ten. Are you sure? I can't stop it unless I take an action to stop. Well, willingly stop it, but that means stop healing you guys. So, oops, I'm sorry. Um, you can take it off me. Actually, then he will take it off of you. He'll keep it on Jathar, yeah. so you don't heal. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay. Kind of. So Jathar, you still do, All but right. he is going to lay on hands himself. Actually, before he does that, he will actually fight defensively again. Um, one second, one second. Let me go over. Nope, hitting all the wrong buttons. Okay. Um, he is going to... But that would mean... Okay. Okay. He is going to swift action mark this guy for his smite evil. Okay. Is it... Is it evil? It's not evil. Does it reveal what it is? Um, no, what Smite Evil does is it gives me extra damage if it is evil. If it isn't evil, um, then I just get bypass damage resistances. Okay, it's not evil. Okay. Um, I also gain a deflection bonus equal to my charisma against attacks made by the target. Actually. Uh, okay. Actually. It says if the paladin target yeah. is injured, it's not evil, it's might as well say it with no effect. Yeah, I'm just looking at that right now. Huh. Since I didn't read that before, would Warden know if these were evil? Or Do would you he have, have detect no evil? He does have detect evil. I mean, you would have had to cast that. Uh -huh. Uh, I would say you already. Uh, oh. You said you you used it. Um, I will say that's a once a day thing, huh? Yeah, he does have two uses. So if it's wasted, it's wasted. That's fine. I mean, yeah. Okay. You so tried it, and uh, you realize oh. it, it's not specifically evil. He's like, well, fuck. And then he is going to... Um, hmm. He's going to move over here. And then he is going to... That will provoke four attacks again. Yep, I understand that. So he is going to... He's still going to fight defensively. So he's going to swing at the bottom guy who he's flanking with. And then mm -hmm. he's going to move here. Okay, that misses. That's fine. But it chooses to get hit. No, just kidding. Um, <laughs> Does I a 31 hit? Functioning. Yeah, 31 hits me. Oh, uh, that's... Uh, doesn't confirm, so only 7 slashing. Okay. Then a... Nope. And a nope. Uh, 24 doesn't hit you, right? No. Okay. But that's his turn. Okay. These guys. Oh, 
home. Boop. This one chases the cat. No! <laughs> <laughs> um, assessing threat. Assessing threat. Big meaty metal can. Yep. This one goes for Bell. Say 29 hit you. Barely. Six slashing damage. Right. Um, six. Um. Ooh. Yeah. This one runs over here and flanks with its buddy and goes to attack Warden for twenty six. No. <laughs> Praise Wall Twenty. Yeah. And this one has its laser back and starts aiming at Warden. 26 touch. Yes. Take 10 fire damage. Okay. And give me a reflex save. Okay. <laughs> Oh, you didn't no. praise it hard enough. Is that plus two integrated already? Yes. What's the Divine Grace thing? Is that also uh, integrated? Yes. Well, actually, plus two is not integrated. Plus four is. Um... Alright, this is not enchantment, though. So, right. Oh, no. Uh, but Divine Grace is here. You catch on fire and take five fire damage. Oh my lord. Stop dying, damn it. This one. Wants to roll me a D three. Uh, okay. Oh, sorry. I... Uh, Slebo keeps sacrificing herself. God damn it! That's just who I am. <laughs> how bad are you? Uh, how bad are you looking there, buddy? Not too great. Uh, this one points its laser at you. Oof. An 18 doesn't confirm on you, does it? No. Okay. You only take 8 fire damage. Does it get reduced again? Because I'm still wet. Well. Roll really, me. Really <laughs> it was just a flag in the water. It was not a whole barrel. Um, roll me a d4. Okay. Uh, okay, for two attacks, it will absorb half. So. This is the second laser you're getting, so it's only four damage. Okay. And you, again, don't catch on fire because you're wet. Ooh! But now your protection has evaporated and you're dry again. <laughs> Fine. Last one. Over here. Hit you for critical one. Ooh. How dare you give us heart attacks like that? Does it explode? No, no, it's uh, it it tries to hit you with the scimitar. It doesn't have its laser back. Okay. Um. Hmm. 
I will give you a an attack, just a flat attack roll. Mm. Wait, how do I do that? Uh, there's a button called melee. Oh. Nice. Damn. Easy. Because of this crit, you see it e coming easily. Uh, you deflect it. And redirect its attack straight at its buddy over here. Oh, yeah. Which gets stabbed for damage. Does it look like this one does more damage to this body than I do? Nope. Uh, you still hear the very uh, recognizable clink against metal. Not How big are they? They're small. So I can They're pick about... them up as metal. They're smaller than a gnome, if I remember correctly. Yeah, about okay. smaller than a gnome. So about two and a half to three feet. Okay. Is it my turn? Oh, that's their turn. Yes, it's your turn. Okay, I'm going to step over here and dump a flask of water over Warden. You have another one? I have three. Uh, yeah, you definitely are able to do that. So he's not on fire anymore? Yes. Okay. He's what does it take out my full round action? Mm -hmm. uh, I would say that's an action to pour it over him. Okay, what does that leave him. me with? So, yeah. I think uh, it leaves you with swift action. Can I, as a swift action, pick this one up and throw it? I would say that would be a action. Okay. Uh, Ooh, bet they am. God, so disappointed. No. <laughs> <laughs> she ain't got enough green in her, boys. I'm sorry. Uh, is that your turn? <clears throat> that is my turn. I'm gonna scream at you, Please pour a potion in his mouth. It's already open and he's drooling. <laughs> <laughs> really, what happened to cutting us loose here? Collecting more bounty for yourself. Yeah. Well. Not when it comes to me. <laughs> you're not healing me. <laughs> mm -hmm. Uh, at the top of the round, you see B over here pushing what seems to be uh, the top of the heap down in an avalanche. I need. <laughs> Playbell to give me a reflex. Clever a girl reflex. indeed. Okay, God. let's see. Um, I forget again what I'm rolling here. I'm sorry. It's, rough. Like, it's just rough. a rough. Yeah, I'm sorry. Underneath touch. I only did it like five times before. 18's pretty good. Yeah, 18 seems nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very respectable. Uh, that's nice, but is it nice enough? Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> uh, roll me in acrobatics. Ooh, acrobatics is my favorite. Nice. Very nice. You, you see it happening, and you move around uh, easy enough. You can get a free five-foot step. Uh, Ooh. Move closer. Uh, I'm not uh, sure to I'm avoid close. this cone over here. Okay, yeah, yeah. I'll then then I'll step this way. Um, that's me. Roll the damage. Le damage. One, two, three, four. <laughs> it's not great. Thank you. Still a clever girl, all the same. Sorry, I have to roll bulk macro. Yeah, great, all well, this anticipation. Ugh. 
You have done this to oh, yourself man. by introducing multiple enemies. <laughs> Welcome to my nightmare. Yeah. And by giving them multiple initiatives. Yep. That's basically... A failure. This one... God. To use for that. Uh, whatever. Uh, B pushes this pile of gold at the top. And it causes an avalanche barreling down. Covering... Basically, this area over here. Uh, this one manages to just get entangled. Uh, basically, his feet are stuck in uh, the avalanche. Ooh. This one dies and explodes. Uh, <laughs> so, roll me a d2. For the direction. I can do that. Actually. Or do you need somebody else? Yeah. Uh, I was thinking D4, but no, I'll be, I'll be nice. Give me a D2. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> oh, please roll 20 dice cards. Two. Uh, two, yeah. Am I muted? No, I'm not. Uh, this one self-destructs into this direction. Oh, nice. Dealing damage to this one. We've seen this happen twice already. Can we ascertain where the uh, explosion is coming from? Them dying. You know what I meant. <laughs> you know exactly where I meant. <laughs> it's literally under a pile of gold. Uh, all it was, you saw a pile of gold to cover it, and then <laughs> basically you're all I'll give you, I'll pelted give you by gold coins. And Warden takes one gold coin damage. <laughs> <Just kidding. laughs> But that heals him because he's greedy. <laughs> he's a greedy little motherfucker. <laughs> uh, let's see, that's uh, 6, 11, 13. And this one's dead. This one is entangled. <laughs> And uh, takes that damage. Brilliant. And this one is not entangled. Still takes damage. Right, that was B's turn. Nice. Warden would have cut off the life link between him and Jathar. <laughs> hey, you asshole. <laughs> I'm at one health point. <laughs> I got, no, I got you, dude. I got you. <laughs> Bro, I got you. I got you. Don't worry about it. It's my turn, right? This one is on Stern, but he's dead. So, Jithar. Okay. I'll use my move action. I'm going to get right up here to Warden. And I am going to give him a moderate healing potion, which I need to adjust my uh, uh, my numbers here so that I can... Oh, no, not 1.999. Why does it do that? Okay, instead of two, it should just give me one. Uh, okay. So, uh, I will say uh, giving someone a potion is going to provoke attack of opportunity. Where you're standing right now, you're going to get attack of opportunity from both of these. I am... Oh, so you want to stand here then? So yeah, if you stand there, you only get one attack of opportunity. Ah, uh, I'll do that. Um, but I will administer that uh, that potion to him right now here, and that was uh, two d eight plus three, if I'm not mistaken. Correct? Yeah. Yep. And thank you very much. That, does that is a twelve. Oh, 
Nice. Get your ass off the floor. There's n- there no laying down on the job here. The 24 hit you. The 20, uh, 24 hit me? Uh, n- uh, barely. Okay, well then you're barely hit for six slashing. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. Uh, so let's see. I've I've moved and I have uh, administered. So I have nothing left but uh, swift actions, and I don't have anything that uses a swift action, unfortunately. So uh, that's turn. Warden. Okay. Uh, Warden did still finish or end his life link, but. He will plant his feet as a move action, get Boots of the Earth going. He will swift action, lay on hands himself. Aren't you going to attack first? Nope, because as a standard action, he is going to reconnect lifelink between himself and Jithar. Mm. So okay. I do not collect benefits of it this turn, but next turn. Yep. Good to see you up again, Jan. <laughs> is that your turn? That is my turn. Alright. These guys. Um, and in quick question. Um, fast healing takes place after on my next turn, right? Um, it should, yeah. Because it just says, gives me fast healing one. So, yeah. So, on my next turn, I start healing. I don't know. Uh,. It says per round, so I will say you get it to this round. Nice. Okay. Thank you very much. I appreciate the mercy. Mercy? What mercy? Mercy is for the weak <laughs> and the greedy. First Continue you stand around greedy. doing nothing, then you take oh, a nap. Oh, oh. Take a nap? I've been taking beating. Well, that's what you get when you stand there doing nothing. Mm, you don't look too badly beaten from my perspective, Nyan. Exactly. You haven't even been cleaning your armor. Jesus. Is this the thanks a healer gets? No wonder they all quit. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't our last healer named Mercy too, Nyan? Sorry. Okay. So what do these little bastards do? Uh, yeah. So this one uh, runs over to here Woo. and attempts to attack Sleigh Bell for 19 to hit. No. It's not good. Definitely. Like, get the fuck away from me. Dirty little thing. Oh. Yikes. This one has its laser back and scans the three of you and then uh, locks its gaze back on Warden. This one likes me a little too much. Oh, did you worry? You're wet now. Oh, you know. that's right. Come at me, you mm. bag of bolts. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you take three fire damage and you don't catch on fire. Also, roll me a d4. Okay. Just roll a four. Oh, three. three. Not bad. Well, three. You, are, you are safe. Oh, you have resistance against this laser for two more attacks. Okay, cool. Uh, this one needs to free itself. It will attempt. To... Oh, natural twenty. Yeah, it's no longer. In no. The... Yes. Go back in there and bury yourself. <laughs> I will say it will take its action uh, to dig itself out. Nice. 
You are not the creator. No, we'll run over there, which will provoke an attack of opportunity from no one. <laughs> well, B can like cause another cool. avalanche. <laughs> Uh, this one will remain entangled, but it will attempt to hit Warden for a 23 to hit. No! Burn. Wait, just barely, actually. Dang it. Wait, it does hit? Yeah, just barely hits. Six slashing. Six slashing, okay. Oh my god, I hit you! Yeah. Hooray. <laughs> Quit taking damage, Nyan. <laughs> Sleigh bell. Okay, I'm gonna leap. My final leap. Over here. I'm just gonna risk the attack. So, I roll my acrobatics, yeah? Uh, yeah, it's easy. It's just 10 feet to make it. You do take 8 slashing damage since you rolled a 24. Yeah, okay. Minus 8. And then I'm... 8 you said, right? Yeah. And then I'm going to my bonus save. Uh then I'm going to attack this one. I'm tired too. It's okay. Don't do that. I was I will say uh, uh or rather I will remind you that uh moving uh leaping is a move. Is movement rather. It's not a move action, but it's movement. Oh, I keep forgetting. <laughs> I, I'm gonna step over here. Five step over here. And then attack that one then. Alright. Ooh! Uh, I need to really remember that. Um. Uh. Here. Also, my super sharp thing is off. What does that mean? I like oh. my. My ammo is gone. Right. Uh, it means your blades are no longer razor sharp. Do you remember what it did? Razor sharp? Uh, it gave me plus one, I think, to my attack. Oh, to your damage, I think. Yeah, my it's damage? Plus one, yeah, it's plus one to damage. Oh, okay. So then, uh, okay, so my attacks are still the same. My damage is one less. Right. Um, if you look on your sheet, yes, under weapons and text, you see your must work Wakazashi single hit, right? Uh, yeah, under that, you see temp attack, damage, melee damage, range attack. Yep, and a zero. yeah, uh, yeah, just do minus one next to melee damage. Um, okay, minus one. Okay. Yep. Okay. Uh, so that's still seven plus seven is fourteen. It's twenty-five. Last one misses. No. Yes, it does. Even with a plus three flanking. Wait a minute. Something's off here. Hmm. Sorry. Um. Uh, sorry, I'm just double checking something. Is that your turn, Slavo? Yes. Jithro, your turn. Sorry, um, just double checking something here. For some odd reason, uh, no, oh, that's right. Now it, it it does that already. My bad. Okay, I'm not thinking straight right now. Um, let's see. 
you may want to five foot step down to flank with Warden. So then you also don't get hit by the uh, the other guy. Hmm. Yeah. Hey, that's my shtick. I got me. <laughs> Yeah, I think I I think I see what you mean here. I will move him five foot step right there, and this guy right here needs to stop hitting on my on my buddy here. Despite me wanting to get more money here, it's not <laughs> worth it if I have to go hunting for a new buddy here. That is a Ooh, nice. twenty-seven. Nice. Unfortunately, a 15 to confirm. Just missed. So only six However, damage. However, you deal minimal damage. Um, um, it is, however, a sneak. So that does add a bit to, on, to it. Yep. And you get a debilitating attack now. Oh. Ooh. Oh, that is true. I get a debilitate. So... Let's see, what should we want here? What do we want here? Uh, Can we choose its movement, its attack, or its AC? Hmm. Let's go when ahead... When you reduce its attack, does that, is that just its, its attack rating? To hit, yeah. yeah. It's to hit. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, or do we want it easier to hit? Hmm. I haven't done disoriented yet, so let's go ahead and do that one. Sure. So it's going to be no, harder for him to hit me for sure. Yeah, it's a minus four to hit against you and a minus two against anyone else. Yep. Yeah. That's good. That's really good. That's really nice. Mm, debilitating injury is a bitch to be against. Yep. Yeah. Is that your turn? Uh, let's see here. That was move, and that was a attack. Yeah, I think that's going to be all I'm going to need to do here. Right. Warden, you regain one hit point. Yep, I did so. Um, Jathar, you regain five. Warden takes five. He is going to... Um, yeah, he's still going to keep it off. He is going to... Defense, fight defensively and swing onto the left one. That is with the, yeah, that's an eight. No, no, that would, that would not go. But he is going to bonus action. Uh, lay on a hands for his last use. For, oh, okay, that's for healing. 16. Uh, you fought defensively, right? So what's your AC yeah. right now? 27. All of them miss. Actually, okay. this one is a critical miss. Give me a, uh, a, a attack roll. Okay. You just parry it. Okay. I forgot your scimitar is a frost. Don't you do actual magic damage to them? Mm-hmm. Yes. Hit. If he hits. But I get a minus four to my attack rolls. Oh. Because of the fighting defensive. Right, okay. So. so that's his turn. Right. Uh, Their turn. This one gets its laser back. No, don't get your laser back. Roll me D3, someone. I, I rolled it last time. Three. Um, it goes after Jithar. <laughs> no. That's Slay Bell. I tried to suggest it. <laughs> <laughs> You're a... Biggest damage dealer at this point. Uh, yeah, that is 25 to hit. Yeah. Uh, 7 damage. Okay. 
its long ass cooldown and give me a reflex save. A reflex save. 27. Easy. Yeah. You know not to stand still when they're aiming their laser at you. Yeah, you dance. <laughs> you get me. <laughs> <laughs> Right, this one. Yes. It, it will attack. Um, Warden. Okay. Ah, oh, critical hit. Does a twenty-two confirm though? No. Right, so seven slashing damage. Okay. What will this one do? Um, it will attempt to move over here. And flank. Oh. No. Buddy. Stop it. Uh, 28 to hit. Yeah. Six slashing damage. And the last one. Does here. Yeah. Warner not get an attack of opportunity? You do. Actually, Jitar, you get two. I get also, which one was it that attacked Jitar? Is it the one that just moved behind him? Yeah. yeah. This one, yeah. yeah. Okay. If I get an attack on so of opportunity. So it was there. So. When it moved over here, it got an attack of opportunity from Warden. Then continue moving over there and get an attack of opportunity from Jither. Oh. Okay, so I'm guessing neither of us hit. Yeah, neither of you hit. Man, I'm rolling nothing but twos. Yeah. Three times. However, for everything, there is balance. So for your two, I roll a 19. Uh, does yeah, it 31 well. hit you? Warden. Oh, Warden. Yeah, yeah, it hits Warden. Does a 30 confirm? Yep, that confirm. You take 16 slashing damage. Ouch. Motherfucking automatons. I will say that since this one is half buried in gold... You do know it's not very uh, agile right now. So if you're trying to hit it, it would be easier. Okay. By the way, the damage reduction is that rounds or attacks that it lasts? Attacks. Okay. Slay bell. Do it. Uh... Um, yeah, I guess I'll just attack this one. I can't, like, move in someone's space, attack, and then move back, right? Like, no, I can't do that. No, you um, can't end in someone's space. Yeah, uh, so that's just going to be a run of action. Uh, blah, 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 blah. On Damn. this one. Uh, on this one? Yeah. Yeah, that confirms a crit, so that's 16 plus 9 is 25 plus... No, that one misses. Last one plus 6 is 31 damage. Nice. Reduced by a bunch. Uh, can I say to Warden... <laughs> Wait, uh, Scimitar, Scimitar counts as a what? A uh, long sword? What does it count as? Um, Scimitar is a Scimitar, it's its own weapon in Pathfinder. Uh -huh. Can I wield a Scimitar with one hand? It's a one handed uh, It's a one handed saber, basically. I'm gonna say to him, swap weapons here. Uh, sure. And I got my shield I can still bash it with. Yeah, because you're not hitting anything with that. So That's true. <laughs> uh, yeah, I will really I will yeah. I will point out your your jewel wielding a, a jewel balanced 
pair of blades. The moment you break the pair, you will lose that to hit rating. That's one, right? Yeah, it's a plus one to both of them. However, the magical scimitar that he has is a plus one, so you will only lose a plus one to your main blade, your own blade. Okay, okay. Uh, okay, so while I end my turn, let me figure that out. Right, and let me just double check if a scimitar is light, but it's not. A scimitar is a martial weapon, so you still get a minus two to it. So minus one then, because it's a plus one? Right, let me just double check for... It's a minus two. Yeah. It's basically, you nullify all your bonuses with what you have. Uh, but the scimitar is not light, so it will adopt an extra minus two. Um, uh, it doesn't and how much, extra, how much extra damage would the would the scimitar do? One d six cold. On every hit. Yeah. Yes. Plus the normal attack hit. Plus the normal damage of one d six. It's also one d six. Okay. It's a one d six plus one for the normal attack. Okay. I'll just reduce these things, uh, but that will be my turn. All right. Uh, you can say swapsies, but you can't full round attack and do swapsies. So it will um, be next turn. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Swapsies. Uh, right. Uh, at the end of your turn. Start of the round. Damn it. Um, where's, a, where's a good place to get the fuck away from here? And, um, um, yeah. Um, Warden would cut lifelink with, um, Sleigh Bell. It's already broken uh, with me. Yeah, you, you, you had it with me. That. Oh. Yeah, I reestablished it with a, uh, a standard action um, a couple rounds ago. Okay, well then. So if you hadn't healed by one by five one time, then you okay. should. Okay. Um. B is going to attempt to bull rush. I wanted to do that the last time, but then Warden started dying. Uh, let's see, attack of opportunity, uh, five feet, plus five feet for every C and B. Oh. Who's she bull rushing? Uh, she's bull rushing this one. And she bashes it with a sack of coins in front of her. Uh, it goes flying ten feet, actually, pink against here. She rolled a 30. Damn. Well done. Clever girl indeed. Yeah. Uh, it's your turn, Jethar. Uh-huh. So, I am going to go ahead... Now that my attention has been, you know, relatively freed up, I'm going to turn my attention to this, this little fella right here. Just rapidly turn around. I really don't have too, too much that I can do here, so... Uh, just going to go ahead and jab it with the rapier. That is a 20. Yeah, easy hit. But uh, I don't get the sneak attack or the blue. I don't get the sneak attack here, so. Um, no. That's all I can do here. Nine piercing. Warden. Warden is going to. Well, Jathar healed by five. Um, you get one HP. Yep. And I am checking if. 
This costs a standard action. And, okay. Uh, decisions, decisions. Okay. You only gave me one moderate potion, right? Uh, yes. two. Wait, this was a charge action, actually. Sorry, let me go back a little bit. This was a charge action, not a full round action. So B would have given you, uh, well, would have yanked your helmet open and tossed a uh, serious wounds heal, uh, potion in your mouth, which is 3d8 plus 5. Nice. Do I roll that? Uh, I, uh, I can roll it. I did plan on doing that, but I, uh, I got confused with what I was doing. Definitely talking. take that. Okay. Uh, this gives me more options. So that will then be a... <laughs> if I five foot step, I lose Boots of... to the earth. So he is going to... Defensively swing with his shield at the uh, the guy here. Nice, easy hit. Also easy crit. Nice, nice. so entangled. However, you do sense that you're just hitting metal with metal. Why didn't you take your scimitar? Because I thought you had it. No, we're doing the. Yeah, you, you didn't do the swap tees yet. Oh, okay, I thought we did. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, you can take it back, you can... I'll say re- I'll say re-roll just the damage of your scimitar. Okay, then that'd be... Right. Uh, yes. 8 slashing and 5 gold. Right, what was that? Right. Uh, yeah, the slashing again, it's just hitting metal, but the cold damage seems to blast it fully. Okay. And I was give me a. God, what is the action for that? What's the action for swapping your weapons? I'll say um, you'll 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 just after hitting it, you you want to do the swapsies? Yeah. yeah. Oh. Okay. Uh, to give uh you eat it and give me both a reflex. Okay. Dumb. Nice. 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 In sync. Just in sync perfectly. Uh, <laughs> You mirror, th throw your blades, and mirror, catch it. Nice. Uh, you have swapped your weapon successfully. Cool. Is that your turn? You're both That's showing, his turn. You're both showing off again, yeah. It's just in my nature. Right. This one has its laser back. No. It's not yeah. allowed. It's not allowed. So who wants to roll me a D three? I'll do it. It will aim its laser straight at Jitar's face, the one who has just been hitting it. Uh, evasion. Does he oh get cover God. because he's behind um, behind Warden? Oh, he's no, hitting Jithar. Yeah, he's here. Yeah. Oh, this this one, okay. yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought this one. Okay, sorry. I'm a pretty yeah, decent sized cat. Yeah. Last turn. So, uh, who, what is your touch DC? AC, I mean. Uh, touch AC is 15. Um... <sighs> Does is this uh, gonna be an attack that's gonna do half damage if it's uh, if I successfully save? No, Fuck. but it misses. 
Because it rolled a 13. (laughs) Because it rolled a 13? Oh, thank God. (laughs) Praise roll 20! Praise it! Yeah, so it's just... (laughs) Even though it fucks me over on so many things. Yep. Uh... This one is, um... Going to move over here. Boop. And hold its action. I don't like that. And this one's going to move over here. And oh. attack Slaybell. With a 17? <laughs> no. Uh, this one's releasing its held action to pair uh, to flank with a twenty-eight. Yeah, twenty-eight does hit. Seven, slashing. Okay. And this one uh, will attempt to hit B, natural one. <laughs> Yay! So. She's going to attempt to deflect it to fucking barely. Uh, The attack gets. She just hits it away with her dagger. At this direction, hitting him for the absolute minimum. Uh, that's them. Nicely done. Slay bomb. Uh, she's gonna five foot step over here. And then attack. Mm. Oh boy. Oh, jeez. Right. Uh, that's um. Just checking how that worked. Did you give it a minus? Yeah. Right. Um. Let's, let's count this out. This is 8 plus uh, 7 plus 6 plus 8. Right? Mm-hmm. Oh, crap. And the cold damage is full on damage, is 8 damage. Right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's. Let me see. Yeah, it's bloodied. For as far as. Uh, my it's sparking. Things can be bloodied. It's sparking. It's sparking. It's sparky. <laughs> <laughs> Their turn. Yes, that is my turn. Um, let's see. The at top of the round, B will run over here. Um, She's going to attempt to disable it. Uh, well, that's going to take a couple rounds. So, Jithar, your turn. Hmm. Uh, let's see here. Is this one over here focusing on Slaybell? It seems to be standing um, wary of both of you. Fuck. Oh well. I'm gonna go ahead and hit him. 
No sense, no sense wasting a perfectly good opportunity to sneak if, uh, if I can sneak attack. Ah! No. Wait, that's a 14. No. Um, well, with that the most here. devastating things if you roll over a three. <laughs> I know, right? I mean, seriously. If I had rolled over a three, I probably would have gotten him. Oh, well. Uh, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and just five foot step right over here to make sure that my good buddy Warden does not get flanked again from this angle. Mm. Nice. Is your I turn? That's gonna be that's gonna be all I can do at the moment. Warden. Um, quick question that might make me look like a big idiot, but under weapons, like in the settings for it, you know how there is in the attack melee plus blank plus negative because nothing's there plus you know blank as well. Does mm -hmm. that negative? become a stat because of what I'm using as in strength and dex? Or should it stay blank? Um, let's just say blank. That's in case you have a modifier on top of your uh, norm modifier. Because uh, the stat melee uh, already includes your main attack. Okay, okay. Because I thought I've been doing it wrong the whole time. But I've been right. Because otherwise, I would have had some nice bonuses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now, mm -hmm. if you look uh, a bit up AC Melee, there's a cogwheel. Uh, yes. You can see okay. Baptist ability. Yes. Wait a minute. Okay. Gotcha. So that's for, like, a feat, like uh, a cleric who can add their wisdom in addition to their normal gotcha. time. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Well, in that case, all we'll, Warden will do is he will um, fight defensively to attack the right guy. Uh, Jathar, you once again get the five healing if you haven't already. Okay, will do. Um, um, yeah, that misses. Even with its entanglement. Actually, wait, who are you attacking? The entangled one. That's a 10 with flanking. Uh, minus 2. Nah, it still misses. Hey, wait okay. a minute here. I just realized I forgot to add the additional plus 1 to attack here for, um, for weapon focus to the rapier. That is oh. embarrassing. That makes a big difference. Yeah. Yep. Um, yeah. I am Oof. a dummy. Well, to be fair, we're all kind of new to this. <laughs> yep. Yeah. But that will be his turn. Okay, what was the last thing you hit? No, a 15 would have still just barely missed. Yeah, I had a feeling. These things have like an AC of like 16, 17, right? Yeah, 16. I almost forgot to come to the earth. Heal me. Um, Don't forget it. This one just used its laser, so it has a cooldown. Just now. Uh, this one gets its laser back. Let me roll. Uh, anyone wants to roll me a d100? Oh dear. Uh, I can do that. D100, you say? Mm -hmm. Over 75 will mean it. Uh, B will have disabled its eye. Oh. 99. Ooh. Nice. Does not get its eye back. Nice. So it will attack B. 
and misses. With a 15. Uh, this one will attack Warden. 14 misses. Yeah. This one will flank with uh, no one. But I will attack uh, Jithar for 24. Damn it. It's 9 slashing. Damn, he rolled really good for that one. Yeah, Max. And the last one, 17 on Sleigh Bell. Uh, no, misses. Right, Sleigh Bell. Okay. Um, I'm going to try to finish this one. Um, so, I'm going to attack it. Uh, you're not flanking. Do you want to five foot step one to the left? You can? Uh, yes. Yes. I would do wow, that. Wow, look at that. You crit confirm. <laughs> 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 and a 17 on the last one just hits with your plus three. Or it would be a 16. Oh, it's still just hits. All according to plan. Uh, minus. Khajiit has powers if you have coin. Oh dear god. <laughs> That's not right. <laughs> Let me see. I have to redo this. Do this as uh, 7 damage. No. No, don't do that. 7. I thought I did more than that. No. Okay, yeah. Just your last hit kills it. Oh, nice. Nice. So, roll me a d d2. Oh, right. Actually, roll no. me a d4 in this case. Okay. No. Evasion. A4. One. Two. Three. Four. It will explode in this area. Ooh. You're all safe. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> hey, will we begin? Would we be able to see where the explosion originates on it? Um, base its head. Damn it! That's a small target. <laughs> whole thing it's a small the head is the biggest thing on it <laughs> <laughs> again the whole thing is a small target yeah. uh top of the round uh b will continue disabling it and risk an attack of opportunity uh 17 hits Uh, uh, Jithar. Okay. Back to back here. Good buddy Warden's got my back. I've got his back. Let's let's see if we can reduce this one by a little bit more here. Twenty six. Oh, easy. <sighs> I feel vindicated now. <laughs> oh, it it may only just be another ad additional plus one here because of that, but that's it. Still makes me feel better for not being stupid. <laughs> uh, Warden, or are you gonna move? No, uh, I'm not gonna move because I don't want anything to occupy this space here. Yeah. So yeah, Warden. it's his turn. Okay. Thar, plus five to you. Yay. Um, he is going to continue fighting defensively. He is going to swing at the trapped one. 
We'll say that the trap one is currently being disabled. Oh, okay. Then he's just going to swing at the bottom one. Uh, 16 hits. And that's his turn. Okay. One out. Oh no. He doesn't have a red marker anymore. Yes, that means that someone gets to roll a d3. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> um, I'll get it this time. Oh no. Actually, since, since D is now in the picture, it's a d4. Fuck. Go ahead, Slay. Oh, Jethar, you're not lucky. No, I'm I roll once. <laughs> Just <laughs> once. <laughs> oh, Jethar, you are lucky. <laughs> Rolled an 11 to hit. <laughs> uh, yeah. The, just bring up the buckler to block it. Oh, boy. Um... I think we forgot to move things along here. Yeah, it said connection was. Yeah, I'm be getting a little Someone... bit of lag here too. Roll me another d hundred. I can do that. Ten. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Yeah. You um... you you've consistently not praised roll twenty here. I don't know, man. Yeah. Seems that B manages to uh, shut this one down and goes, like... and just as everyone's happy, um, <laughs> something, <laughs> some wiring gets reattached, and it keeps on going. <laughs> However, it's, it's its swinging arm seems limp. Nice. That's good. That's a good thing. Where is the weaknesses? This one. Where are the weaknesses, yeah? This one will run a lap and go out of its way to hit Slayer. No, it will hit the tank again. Jesus Christ! Uh, a critical hit, but it does not confirm. Eight slashing. Okay. Uh, Slayer. Uh, I'm gonna move over here and like fight this one. You uh, could. What? Are you gonna if try you to leave, Do you still get a full round action or no? Not? Okay. I made that mistake twice. Sorry? Mm -hmm. Uh, no, nothing. Uh, uh, but I'm attacking this one. Right, full round? Yes. Um. And get plus three, so only two hits. Yeah, that second one misses. Yeah. And the fourth, fourth one misses too. Yeah. Right. Is that your turn? Yes. Top of the round. Come on, B. You got this. B will now do her last check. Yes. Uh, this one is basically out of commission. Oh, great. Uh, you see, it was trying to swing at uh, Warden, and then it shot down, but came back again, but its swing arm didn't work. And now it's going, B's like, <sniffs> jabs her dagger straight in the back of its skull, wherever she's working, and it goes down again. <laughs> I guess that's simpler. Oh, technician. However, it does not explode. It does Ooh. shut down. Can we do that for all of them? Uh, I will say that 
uh, Jithar and Slabo can give me a perception check. I will okay. do so. I will do so, Nya. Damn it! I rolled a net one. Uh, yeah. No, you don't. You have been consistently looking at these two, uh, uh, at these cre creatures, for weaknesses or whatever. Uh, you don't still have a good idea of any specific uh, parts, other than obviously. Uh, don't get shot by the eye. Yeah. Jithar, your turn. Yeah, no. So I won't I won't know that the head is the weakness then. Um I'm just gonna aim I'm not aiming anywhere. I mean, you, I'm just you can also just assume that as general knowledge. Well, I also have a big meaty uh metal tank right in between me and B, so I can't see. So I, uh, well, she has been she has been working on it for three rounds. It's not True. just that she attacked the head. And I'm just in I'm just not in an ideal position to see her working on it. So I will just go ahead and uh, from the hearts of uh, whatever nether realm we have here, I will stab at this fellow. After you take a five foot step to get flanking, right? I just saw that. Yes, I am definitely going to five foot step to get flanking. And roll 20 gods, please be merciful. 27! Mm -hmm. Yeah. You do feel that uh, as you jab, your sneak does hit a cog and it seems to halt whatever wherever you are aiming it seems your sneak attack was not enough to damage it but it was enough to but it was enough to give me an idea of where i'm going okay yeah however you still got got the sneak attack off so as you pull back your blade you can still do your debilitating injury D what do you think here should i go ahead and should we do uh easier to hit or Harder for them to hit us. Since it's almost dead, maybe harder to hit um, us. All right, then. Okay. Warden. Okay. Uh, Jathar, you heal by five. And Warden is going to, at this point in time, cut off lifelink. That's uh, so a free action. And he is going to... Five foot step here. Actually, no. He can't. So he is just going to turtle up. Defensive attack? He's going to do total defense. Total right. defense. Plus, plus 700 AC. Got it. And, yep. That's his turn. Right. Their turn. This one will attempt to attack you. Obviously miss. <laughs> this one will attempt to attack... Jithar. Alright. It has a minus four to hit you specifically. Mm -hmm. Which makes it a 22 to hit. Oh. <sighs> Bastard. Just barely hits me. <laughs> One seven, seven slashing. Seven slashing. Goodbye, H HP. Uh, that's their turn. Slaybo. Okay, I'm going to try to finish this off. So, I'm going to hit it. Woo! Flank it. Um, uh, 
Uh, your two main hits will kill it. And someone roll me a d4. I got it. I got it. I got it. D4. Two. Unfortunately for you, one, two, it will explode in this direction. Oh no. Fortunately for you, this is a reflex save. Yay. Ah. Which means, oh, I, I do get to, I just remembered that I can reroll saves here too, so only one. Mm -hmm. Eleven, I would like to reroll that. <laughs> <laughs> I would very much like to reroll that here. Um, right. So give me a second here. I will re 26. Ooh. Easy. It explodes. Uh, you see bits of cogs and just metal flying towards you and the explosion of fire from its head. Uh, however, you nimbly dodge all of it because you are Jithar. Well, I've because got, Jithar I've got the cat's meal. luck. I've got the cat's luck. <laughs> and also because you have evasion. Yes. Well, there's that too. Uh, I'm right. going to move over here, my five foot step, and that's my turn. Right. Jithar. Well, top of the round. Uh, yeah, B is not going to do much. Alright. Uh, uh, Sleigh Bell, give me a. Uh, I will say also Warden. Sleigh Bell and Warden can give me a perception. So, before you ask me for, as well for perception. Uh, and I rolled a natural one. No. No, you rolled twenty-three. Yeah. Yeah. Um, sixteen. Yeah. This is not so much looking at the creatures. This is looking at uh, as you step away, uh, looking at something that B is doing. Uh, unfortunately, there's fat ass with a shield in the way. <laughs> big as metal hunk in the way. So this big hunk, okay. So warden, you do see that uh, B is actually opening uh, a compartment in the head. Dave got a head flap. Open it and yeah. stab it. She's actually uh, has her hand reached inside it. Uh, she has Use your down. hand to stab it. Yeah, Jithar, your turn. Oh! So we're just gonna go reach in into a head and stab it. Hmm. You know what? She doesn't seem to be stabbing it. She seems to be reaching. Uh, yeah, but that's not you what did, You told me I didn't need to... You told me I couldn't roll that one here, so... <laughs> oh, right, yeah. And I'm right up here. I would probably be able to see it over the fat ass here. I mean... You were just dodging an explosion. That's why I think oh. you were kind of occupied. <laughs> You're not wrong. You're not wrong. So. Let me see here. Is it possible? Hmm. Yeah, I think it would be possible. I can just take a go ahead and take a five foot step there to get within range. And I'm you know, just full on move and to get a sneak off. Huh. I'm sorry. You, did you just say I could straight off just move and and get around it? Yeah, I mean you will risk one attack, but you have enough health to get one attack. But if you just move over there, you can get the sneak off. <laughs> that will still provoke an attack, <laughs> probably. But uh... uh, fourteen misses. Yeah, it definitely misses here. And I'm going to stab this thing in its head. That is a 25. The, the way you mapped your route, you basically leap over this thing here. Mm -hmm. uh, and as you look down, you do also see B reaching into its head compartment. A 25 easily hits. You get a debilitating injury. Yay! Debilitate him. Um, you have one called kill. <laughs> no. Hampered, Dang. disoriented, uh -huh. and bewildered. Um, 
I'm going to make it harder for him to hit us. Right. He is... Nice. He nice. is disoriented. Uh, Warden. Warden is going to... Regain 1 HP. Yep. And um, fight defensively. He's going to bash the robot. Oh, nice! Six. Yes. You hit it for one damage. Yep. Uh, is that your turn? That is his turn. Alright. It will get its laser back. And... If you say Jathar, I will be happy. <laughs> I don't need the tank no, going down I'm, and wasting resources. I'm going to roll this one. <laughs> it's gonna shoot B. <laughs> no! Intercept it! Um. Laser. Minus two is a 14 to hit. Touch AC. We'll still hit. God damn it. B dies. I'm just kidding. Uh, wow. <laughs> reflex <day. laughs> Means we get all the money. Yeah, she does make the reflex save. She's not on fire, but she's also not very happy. That's its turn. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Scrappy piece of crap. It's been taking so long. Um, you reduce its attack, right? I yeah. did, yes. Yeah, Slave Owl is so annoyed, she's just flinging wildly, and most of it just clanks off its armor. Yeah, just a little bit too much green in her, boys. Just a bit too much. I accidentally stabbed. Jathar. <laughs> Does an 18 hit you? <laughs> Does an 18... Nothing hit... None of those hits except for the first one would hit me. <laughs> okay. Uh, B will step aside and take a potion. Uh, Jithar. Once again, gonna go for the head. That is a 20. Nice. Yes, easy hit. Do I end up uh, getting off that sneak? With an injury. Yes. Well, they don't stack. And seeing as how um, our uh, lovely but furious ranger is <laughs> uh, flailing about here, I think we should switch it from disoriented to bewildered. Nice. Sounds good. Nice. Yeah, you will stab it in the back, in the head, where you assume that its weak spot is, and it just goes... <laughs> it seems bewildered. <laughs> yeah, <I> get help. <laughs> That's all I'm doing. Yeah. Warden. Warden, fight defensively. Smack the head flap. Get Flanking. Death Busted. HP. Uh, is that with the bonus? Uh, with the penalty? Yes. Okay, yeah, that's an easy hit. With eight points of damage, well, I think, what, three? Mm -hmm. If not. That's his turn. I swear to God, if this thing tries to run. <laughs> A 
forgot to do this. It does not have its laser. And it will attack. Jithar. The one who debil the one who debilitated or bewildered it. Yes. Uh, does an eighteen hit you? Uh and was that also Oh yeah yeah yeah. Okay. Uh eighteen does not hit. Nope. That's its turn. Tilt my head to the side. Uh, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll try again to smack it. Um, ooh, the second one doesn't hit, but with the rest of it, actually. No, right, it's due to its AC, you. so. Yeah, no, that would still miss. Um, yeah, you kill it. Give me a d4. Shit! <laughs> Please be in my direction. Oh, oh, it is. And also in Slabo's direction. Hmm. Well. Both give me a reflex save. Yes, sir. Okay. Fifteen. Okay, it's not going out. Okay. I think right. I can uh, only use... Jizar, you... Jizar just makes it. And again, he nimbly evades all the flying debris and the fire. Uh, Slaybell, you also nimbly evade, but only for half damage. So you take okay. uh, two slashing and three fire for a total of six. Okay. Okay. Cat's luck once per day. I'm glad I used it on the nat one. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Right. Oh, I don't know about any of you, but I need a lie down for a bit. You already did that. I need to do it again. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Here, take this. Yeah. Hey, he's going to hand him one of the regular healing potions. Uh, yeah, I had, also... I had two. Yeah, I'm also going to say, you. Oh, here you go, big guy. I'm going to give you my moderate healing potion. So that is 3d8 plus 3 in total. 1d8 uh, from normal, 2d8 from... Technically, if, you're, if it's adding up here, uh, because... Uh, Healing po uh, regular healing potion is uh, 1d8 plus uh, 1 here. Are we? Does, yeah, do okay. those stack, uh, DM? Uh, what do you mean, stack? Well, would it would it be plus, Would it not be 3d8 plus 4 if it, if he's taking uh, a moderate? Uh, no, they're consecutive. Okay. So whichever one. You... Yeah. So you would have to roll them uh, each individually here. Mm-hmm. So, so can one d eight plus one, one d eight plus one, and another gives me two d eight plus two, or plus three. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Just do, yeah. Uh, just roll three d eight plus four. Oh, oof, that one. About thirteen. Fantastic. Thank How about you. I roll for you next time? I seem to be having pretty good luck this this round. <laughs> yeah. I mean, if you stand still for just a single minute, you gain 10 hit points. That's true. Which he will do. Okay, what is everyone else doing while a Warden is standing still? I'm gonna walk up to DB, I mean. And I'm gonna say, well, thank you for your help. That was, uh, that was uh, very good. Don't know what you did there in the back of the head, but whatever you did, it was very helpful. Use the head flap. Quiet she, okay. she slightly tilts her head and gives Slabo a little cheeky grin as she holds up her hand and between her index and thumb she's holding a small stone. Is that what they run on? Sorry, what? Is that what they run on? Uh, she says I 
don't think this is their power core, but this is definitely something that was powering them in a way. And she uh, gives it to you. Hmm. Oh, she's going to respect it, I guess. Yes. Uh, this is an Ayun stone, which gives you a plus one morale bonus on all attacks, saves, skill checks, and ability checks. Mm. I'm gonna look around. All of them have that. Uh, she looks around. All of them have exploded, apart from the one she disabled. Uh, she says, we can try to see if they survived. Mm. Everyone look for blue gems. I gotta stand still for a bit longer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, this is a... Flawed pale green prism stone. Oh, everyone look around for green stones. I'm just gonna start looting. If I find any of them, I'll let her know. Yeah, Jitha, you definitely find some green stones, but that's because this whole mount is full with green gems. <laughs> mm, too many green gems out here, yeah. Fine. Roll me uh What is this? Two D no oh, three D two. You need me to roll that? Okay. Damn it. <laughs> two Slay Bell. Yeah. Find one more of these gems. Mm. The other seems to have either scattered somewhere into the loot pile and are probably un impossible to find, like a needle in a haystack. Uh, or just exploded, who knows. But you find one. So you have two. I'm gonna walk over to Warden and I'm gonna sort of like put it in front of his head and then walk away. Or was is this my payment? Does it start circling done? around his head? Um, he would have to do it himself. Oh. just set it on the yep, ground in front is, of him. It's worth a lot. Oh, pockets. No, go use it. But there's no shop here. <sighs> You could temporarily, uh, it's like a magic item. No, oh, you like, should have said that from the beginning. Uh, I'm sorry. Um, is it just for the muscles? <laughs> yeah. We should probably give it to Jithar. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start getting... Is it only one that we have of those? The two. Yeah, yeah, two of them. Uh, Slaybell has one of them. Uh, you two I will fight say off. it's better on Jathar because I get negatives to my attacks anyway. Yeah, just give it to Jathar. Yeah. It's better. And, so, uh, after focusing on it and shaking it for a while, I was like, I don't know what to do with this. And he just tosses it at him. Uh, he just tosses it like behind you yeah. and it lands on Jathar. Uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll catch it. I'm looking for anything <laughs> shiny right now. Right, so Jithar, you got. Uh, I'll create a buff for you. Oh, if I please. Touch your sheet. Yeah, sure, 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 sure. You can touch my sheet. I was just going to go ahead. I'm and... going to. Oh. Sorry. I know, you're fine. I am going to stand here. I'm like, going to grab Santa's bag. I'm going to stand here and say, like, okay, B. I'm going to stand under this mount. Do you, do you want to cause an avalanche and, like, just. Make all of the coins fall in the bag. Uh, will you guys spend uh, a considerable time uh, looting as much as you can and filling up Santa's bag? Warden will... Um, Warden will say, well, while we're all grabbing stuff, I might as well go secure the door. Don't want anybody walking in. Oh, that sounds like a good idea. And he'll move over, and he'll stand by the door, 
close it and he'll hold it there himself because he doesn't have pittance or anything. Oh my God. But he's going to, once again, boot to the earth on the ground and you'll keep healing there every time. Um, and I would say, I don't think we just would try to put in the most, but also kind of look like what's most valuable. Well, that's one of the things that I was trying to to get at here. I'm not just loot. I'm not just uh, randomly looting here. I'm actually looking for specific for things that look like they're artifacts. Yeah. And just to know, to let you know, while he is doing this, he is using crystals. So to regain his lay on hands. Yeah. All right. And you have plenty well, of them now. A short rest isn't a thing. So, um, yeah. You guys will either have to long rest here or bail before anyone notices you guys were here. I guess we'll have to go. We have no choice. Let's loot what we can and leave. Yeah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna say to Warden. Uh, hello. I'm hurt. Oh, <laughs> right. And he's going to create <clears throat> life links with both of them. So you guys, every six seconds, get five healing, or every minute, get 50. Or, yeah, 50. <laughs> One, five, five, zero. Five, zero. So can I just say I'm full health then? Yeah. After a minute? Okay. Yeah, sure. He would, once he gets low, cut off the healing. Let himself build back up with Boots of the Earth, okay. then mm -hmm. connect. Yeah, so it will take a, a good, uh, let's say, 30 minutes or so before everything is fully healed up, at least or so, right? Okay. Yeah. And, and but also, since we're kind of thoroughly looting, I suppose we would indeed, like, take quite some time. Yeah. Um, I will say um, you guys managed to abscond with, like, astronomical amounts of platinum and gold. So there's no point in t saying numbers because this is just literally Ooh. mountains of gold and platinum. Mountains. Which will be all distributed much later. Yes. Uh, you are looking for artifacts. While you do find valuable things like crowns and golden swords here and there yeah. uh, and things, there's not specifically any artifacts. You feel that anything that would have magical value would not be held in this particular vault here. This is literally just for monetary value, it seems. There's perhaps more than one vault. Yeah. I'm gonna look up at B and say, is this true? Uh, she looks actually already very happy about what uh, you guys got, but uh, when you bring it up, she does throw her brow and says, I have never been this far. We are the first ones to actually successfully do this. If there is a second fault, perhaps that warrants a second mission another time. The I did grow... the Today grows dark, though. I think we should soon leave before the host returns. Sounds like a good idea to me. So, uh, since Santa uses those reindeer and we have this star map, do you think we'll hitch a ride? Ah, uh, no, yeah. They were very perturbed at our presence, yeah. This is true. She gives a thumbs up to Warden. Then for now, we leave. It should be easy enough to get by them. With... I... I do have to agree with Jithar here. I don't think they would take kindly to our orders. Unless you are extremely charismatic with animals. <laughs> if you could uh, call them even animals. I am very proficient with men, 
but not all animals. Um, so I suppose <laughs> you should go. I'm not proficient with men, but I'm proficient with animals. How proficient? I am an animal. I have time with them. Oh, that's not the same thing, Warden. I am an animal, yeah. <laughs> so, um, you have just looted, I would say, let me see. 200,000 platinum! <laughs> I would say you have got uh, looted so much from this entire pile in this room that was bursting with light in this uh, chamber just from the sheer amount of it. Some places are touching the ground. You can see the floor. You have gotten about half of the great mounds that you see here on the map itself. Oh. <laughs> and a lot of children didn't get any food or presents the next 10 years. Well, that's not your problem. Mm, exactly. Indeed. indeed, it isn't our problem, yeah. The claws shouldn't have been stingy. It is oh, actually ex extremely um, weird to see that all of that fit in that single bag. And when you lift it, you know how bags of uh, holding work. You know that they're not heavy. But after putting half of this room into the bag, you're still a bit like, huh, huh. It's, it's still only 60 pounds. <laughs> this is a good sack. Hmm. I mean, As you all leave, give me stealth. Oh, group stealth check, everybody. <laughs> what? <laughs> how the hell do you <laughs> roll a zero? <laughs> God damn it. What the fuck? Uh, you all go through the corridor. Uh... That leads back to the chamber behind the throne room where you found all the books and the hat and the sack. And the entire way, you just hear clink, 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 clink. A warden just walk in. It's like, not caring anymore. He's done, I think, with his job. They, like, they forgot fine. to return a weapon so the wakisashi doesn't fit in his scabbard. This is clinging <laughs> against him. Oh my right. god, give me that thing back. Oh, right. I'll take mine back too. No. Oh, okay. Star, give me something. <laughs> Just hand him a standard dagger at this point. <laughs> I'll add a dagger to my inventory. I'm gonna give him a pitten. Okay. Oh, pitten. Oh, dear God. Yeah, pitten. Um. I could have used this just, for the tour. <laughs> he just face palms. <laughs> as you all walk out and <laughs> through the chamber with the hearth uh, blazing giving you all heat as you open the oaken door into the large throne room you all take a sneak peek and give me perception uh, on point uh, I think that'd be Jathar yeah uh uh, over are are we overhearing things? I'll say both. Okay. So, uh, then that would be plus four to that here. That would be thirteen or twenty-three. Yeah, for you actually don't see a whole lot, but your keen cat ears do overhear. Uh. There's a bit more talking outside of the front door. Great uh, barricaded door. Okay. Um, I hear some talking. Uh, is it in that strange language again? Yeah, it is. Got it's uh, you. You. You've heard them just speak before just uh, but uh, was just in conversational tones this seems to be slightly louder you can't really hear a whole lot just now and then you hear a single one uh bark out something hmm. uh, they're on the other side of the great doors yeah but at this point you just entered the throne room and the great doors are like 30 feet away so it's 
still a bit far away to hear. I'll motion everybody to be quiet. <laughs> looking over at Warden. <laughs> and then Jathar will slowly and methodically make his way over to the great doors and see how and try to see how close these people are. Right, the great door is a giant gate that is barricaded. Oh. Like well, heavy oak doors. You can put your ear to the door. Yeah, that's what I mean. Um, I won't let you, I won't have you roll for this, but you can definitely hear there's commotion. I'm going to start walking to the side door that we came in through. Um, after fi figuring out that there's a commotion, we'll definitely uh, follow Slaybell's uh, lead there. Alright, as you go to the, to the uh, door, you see that at the end of the hallway where it's supposed to be dark, um, there are now several torches and they're turning a corner. That's not good. Is there another door? It's only the great door. Or, um... Uh, you can roll me perception, everyone. I yes. will... I will do so. Fuck. If I'm keeping my ears open here, or for traps here, maybe, but... Yeah, no. Unfortunately, with your four, you don't see anything about... regarding traps. Um, you... only... You can only either fight these elves whatever they are that are um, coming through the corridor um, that leads to the stables to, to the uh, uh, construction site or you can attempt to go through the great door yeah I don't think I want to go hug the reindeers but I'm good with animals then like, we go through th really good animals. then we go through the front I gates know. then hmm Straight shot, no fighting, just running. Yeah. Sounds like that might be our only option. Be not determined, uh, Jithar. Then we make out like true bandits. Then, yeah. <laughs> uh, is there a way to open these uh, big old oaken doors without having to expend too much strength here? Nope. I will turn very keenly to our two strongest peoples here. Motion to the doors. And say, <laughs> your moves. Find a lady will fix it. But do I need to roll? I did say oh, two. This would be a straight strength check. From both or from one? Level you can help seven. her out. Yeah, Warden Wood. What does that mean if I help her? Uh, eight others. Oh, Lord, you uh, provide basically plus two. eight. Eight others plus two. Okay. E. And with a fifteen, it doesn't seem to budge you you're gonna need uh, a minute longer if you're gonna do this give me another strength check as these other guards start closing in through the corridor 15 15 you rolled an 18 plus 2 that would be 20 your base roll oh Not sure. oh sorry I was looking at your perception yeah that's a 20 um She's that will shrunk. still require will still require uh, not a minute but another roll uh, I can add uh, I can add another plus two to that here if uh, warden's still helping yep he still is yep. uh, Damn I'm it. gonna turn around and say you know I changed my mind I want to go I want to I want to go the other way the other door 
Does that mean I get to play with the weird horses? Yes. Yes, Warden. All right. I'm in. You spoil him too much, yeah. Uh, P says, I, I, I really don't know if that's the best idea. Plans win, Sarah Woman. Let's go. <laughs> uh, does it look like there's any sort of locking mechanism on this thing here? No, you guys have have lifted the barricade. It's just not completely off its hinges yet. God damn it. Okay, then... So either you can just give up and drop it again, or you can uh, fight these... You uh, spoil guard. him too much. Give it one more shot. I'll help out a little bit more this time. Fine, fine. fine. Uh, you need to also roll me straight, straight strength. Straight strength, you got it. Straight strength. It's a fifteen. What do I have? Twenty points in strength form. A warden. Holy oh, smack! Yeah. With both of them helping, they just need to reach a DC ten to aid you. They both give you a plus four for an eighteen. You're the main one lifting. You managed oh, right. to lift this up. We're lifting, not pushing. I see. Uh, uh, I uh, yeah, Slay Bell, who seems to be quite uh, slim and nimble, just pulls out these guns <laughs> and lifts this thing. With she the Master yeah. Roshis. I pull up Basically. my sleeves and I roll up my sleeves. And like as she starts lifting, she has this like kind of dainty arms. But as she starts lifting, you see like these muscles bulging and and, and <laughs> popping. <laughs> and then she just has to say, "Stop pushing it down, damn it!" <laughs> yeah, she's going totally Super Saiyan. Um, Stop leaning on it. <laughs> yeah, you all lift this thing up, and with a loud bang, <sighs> the uh, barricade falls on the floor, and you hear. In the corridor, a faint uh, seas of noise, as they seem to be listening. And what are you doing in this moment? Uh, shoving the door open and running like bandits. Yep. Yeah. Right, as you shove the door open... Uh, I'm gonna vanish with my ring. Sticking to the shadows. Fast. Right. I uh, will just say as as um, Gizar shoves the door open, uh, B makes a hand motion and the shimmer comes across all of you again. Ooh. All right. Uh, she does say, "Run!" As keep up. from the side corridor, from the side corridor, you do hear. And they, you see lights just flickering uh, from the side of the tunnel and they're coming closer. I'm gonna put you all here. Oh dear. It'll take me a bit to get there. Yeah, sorry, I had to ready it. Yay. Can you see? Yep. yep. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. All right. You're all here and you're currently invisible. Okay. I'm guessing this is the way out. Right this way here to go down here, right? If you zoom out a little bit. Yep. You know that this is the way. <laughs> this is the way. Uh, did you ping it here? Because I'm... I didn't see yeah. it either. I haven't seen it. Are you on the right I layer? Think you... uh, is there... Oh, no, I'm not on right layer. Oh, oh damn it. Fuck. Oh my god. Can I just climb this wall? 
I can you break. can definitely try. Oh, I mean, we do I'm see gonna... over here. There's ballista. Yeah, <sighs> um, I'm okay, gonna go ahead and just look over to Warden real quick. You cannot break that. If your girlfriend could break it. Oh, yeah. Wait. Are we a couple now? Is it official? Yep. No. I'll ship it. Oh. <laughs> I have a. <laughs> uh, just Felix a. Felix disappointed. <laughs> Let's keep running, less talking. Right. Um, as you all start running... Um... Wait, wait. I have uh -huh. an idea. No. Oh, no. no. What, what if we take out that tower and then run over the roof? Can you, cl yeah. can you climb the roof? Running. Yeah. Just... No, you can't. Okay. Run and no more talking. Oh. You do hear behind you. Uh, whoever was in that tunnel mm -hmm. is now out in the hall. Is now is now about here inside. Yeah. No, okay. we're running. We're running. We are. We're going around these people. Yeah. Right. Okay. And since we can't all move as one here at the moment. Yeah, give me stealth checks. Uh, you're going to be running at. Uh, well, since you're all. No. Oh, do you have your shield out? Warden? Mm hmm. Uh, Warden would always have his shield out. Please, please, please. I don't mean, I don't, 24, okay. I don't, I don't mean that shield. I mean, yeah, a shield. Gauntlet, shield. gauntlet shield. For cold uh, environment. Your movement. The floating disc? Oh, the floating disc. disc. Yeah. Uh, no, he'd only have that for ice. But this just looks like snow. Yeah, it's still slippery, though. Oh. So, um... Okay. It does seem that there is going to be a five-foot penalty with how thick the snowball is. So, Whereas, moving, moving at the slowest party member, you would move about 15 feet per round. He would put on the, uh, or use the floating disc. So that's the second use of the day. The two of, uh, well, what is it? Uh, Slaybell and Jathar have, uh, have the boots here that allow us to pretty much walk on snow. Mm -hmm. So we should be fine. Uh, yeah, since you're all stealthing, uh, can you... Actually, I will leave Warden out of this stealth check because he's... Um, and... B will actually do what uh, Slaybell did before, and B will stand behind you, piggybacking. Uh, you can move 30 feet. Okay, good. Um, yeah, let's start moving along the path here, then, guys. Do we now get the favorite terrain bonus again? Or yeah, was it? we're outside, so... Uh... I won't call this favorite terrain just yet. You're still inside um, a complex. It's just snow. You're not in a terrain. It <laughs> it's uh, it's not a cold terrain. You're inside a complex. It, well, we'll go with his reasoning for right now here. Then, when it comes yeah. time for mutiny, then we'll meet mutiny. <laughs> <laughs> in the meantime uh, we need to get out of here behind you yeah, behind you you do hear that uh, they have noticed that this door is now open it literally just opened next to them just now there was a loud bang and it's the barricade Maybe. so the they're way. moving it's okay <laughs> none of us are leaving tracks here anyhow so it's fine that's correct you guys are super lucky with Josh finding those boots <laughs> Yes. We're pissing uh, you off, Afa. 
gather around them. Go, 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 go. You see over here, um, our guards patrolling. They're they're looking around. So we're moving over here then. Yep. He's gonna be really quiet, yeah, and try to not disturb anything. Uh, all them move around them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're already moving at half speed, but dashing. So you're still. That's why you're getting thirty feet quietly. Mm -hmm. Oh, we shouldn't be. Uh, oh, because we're moving at the, our slowest member's pace here. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you can run ahead and just leave everyone behind, but Bell has the uh, has the sack. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, we could definitely be the uh, the distraction, but that doesn't seem very prudent at the moment. All right. Yeah. Um. Uh, give okay. me another stealth check as you move on. Okie dokie. I'm applying guidance on... Uh, yeah, Sleigh Bell. Alright. Looks like you don't need it. Nah. But we'll hold on to that here for the next time. I know it doesn't do that, but that's fine. Right. Uh, move another 30 feet. Alright. And then I apply it on Chathar. Right. Now, clearly behind you, you do hear some talking in another language. And it's loud and it's drawing attention. And it doesn't take a genius to know linguistics or anything. That They know that something's not right. There's probably intruders and an alarm is being sound right now. Mm. Uh, everyone seems to be scrambling. And uh, give me a reflex save for Jithar. Reflex save. Oh dear. Please. Okay. 24. You have a plus one if you want to use it. If this is it in regards to traps, I have a plus two to that. I will remove B from the uh, map because she's basically okay. standing behind, right behind Borden. Yeah. Uh, yeah, with a 24, you easily uh, manage to just hug the wall as these two dash and rush around the corner. Uh, in response to the alarm. You stay for a few seconds and you decide to continue on. Okay. Yeah. Right here. Move, move another thirty feet. I just did. All right. Oop. I need to move my, the. Uh, I need to zoom out a little bit more on the uh, the main screen here. There we go. After hearing this bell, um, you do see more people scrambling guards running around and taking positions. They're looking around. And you hear a, a strange sound, but it goes throughout the entire complex. And it's sort of a ripple. And when it passes Ooh. all of you, you hear the no. and the shimmer fades around you. Fuck no! He I'm looks smiling. very not happy. She says, "Anti magic, run, run!" Fuck. Okay, well I'm dashing. We're all dashing then. Uh, so that's yeah. uh, so that's a full sixty feet then. Ha ha ha! I am going. Would it uh, fast stealth? You can stealth, but these people can now clearly see you. Eh. Warden can't really dash, can he? No, no he's, he's stuck to the speed of, of his shield, which is 30. I'm going to tell Warden to sit on his shield, and I'm going to give him a rope, and I'm going to run and pull him. 
but that still just moves uh, it on 30 feet. Yeah. Oh, no, you can you can you can move it willingly 30 feet. If someone balloons you, I will oh. say it is still just a levitating shield. It's a floating disc. Cool beans. The move is magical. All right, so we... uh, I will say that will cost you a strength check. Yeah. Yeah, that, Which that you are sense. really good at. I will assume that you're going to get guidance for that, so that's a plus one. Well, she still has the plus one until it's been... Unless a minute has passed. Uh, Well, yeah. Hasn't she used it yet? Uh, no. no. Oh, then, Jathar yeah. did, I believe. He e e easily uh -huh. pulled him uh, behind you. However, this ballista does notice you and attempts to shoot. Turtle up! <laughs> 15 does not hit any of you right now. Nope. Hold and hold up your shield! No, I got it. I've got a shield. Remember? So I will use my buckler to just basically knock it upwards into the air. These guys also see you and shoot. No, a 10. It shoots. There's snow flying everywhere with these ballista just impacting on the ground next to you um, doesn't hit but snow definitely makes uh uh what's it called so, so uh obscure your vision a little bit yeah, oh, yeah. 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 your vision a little bit with obscure. all the powder snow except for slaybo you just managed to see right through it nice can uh yeah give me another dash as uh yeah so dang dang and another strength as well uh, yeah i'm assuming you're uh guidancing me for that yep i uh, basically every minute that's passed where you guys use it i guidance for break and touch mm -hmm. right um uh, i will need everyone to give me reflex saves just for mm -hmm. trying to run past these elves without getting nicked. Yeah, that makes sense. Fuck! Alright. Um, I will say... Is this technically a trap? <laughs> no. Uh, it's, it's, uh, <laughs> it's a... One. As you run past a bunch of these elves you unfortunately are just focusing on dashing more than defending you take 14 slashing damage that's uh, fine we're trying to run we're trying to run out of here anyhow yes it's here uh, just hear the cat go Row! this one slowly turns attempts to shoot also misses Oof. Give me another uh, yeah, ballista. Have a very low hit rating, but they get consecutive bonuses. Mm. So don't stand still too long. <laughs> yeah, no. Are we allowed to move now? Yeah, you can dash another. Yay! <laughs> so I rolled a nine right there. Even with a guidance, that's not going to be all too high. So how far do I get to pull him? Uh, you just. You don't. He just moves 30 feet with his own magic. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So he can only move 30 feet this round here. Not strong enough to to uh, balloon him along. So he'll just be there. I am it? gonna stay there to try and do it next time. Move over here so that people can see where everybody is. Yep. This one will now also attempt to shoot at you guys. Hurt. Well, I'm the one that's easiest oh, to see. Remiss, like a seven. <laughs> Can I deflect it into I the, need... this guy right here? <laughs> Everyone to roll me reflexes as they rush past these guys. Oh, fuck. Not again. Not again. Uh, reflex. 30. With a 15 start, though. Uh, 60. 16? Uh, oh, you're using your guidance? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. In case you're fine. Uh, you all run past. And you can see that uh, there's a lot of these guards over here. In the courtyard. Karak! 
with with the gate here. This is the. What happened? You, you cut, cut off. off. You cut off a little bit. What? Oh, I hope your microphone didn't die or something. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. Oh, there. There you are. We still can't hear you, though. Can't hear you, brother. Ah. Let me try to reconnect and... I still can't hear him. Uh oh. It could be his Discord went out. Oh oh. Hello. Ah, there you yes. are. Yeah, hi, hi, hi. Right. I don't know what it was. Uh, no route detected. Well, it's back now. Uh, so yeah, this is the um gate that you guys initially found. Uh, and these two heaps of red snow here have been discovered. And there's a bunch of elves standing guard there now. Oh, uh, right. Are practically surrounded as you move on. Okay. Um, I'm going to bull rush the, the elves then. At this point. Uh, yeah, at this point, for sake of narration, I'm going to say that uh, you can attempt that, but they will start slashing at you. And mm. it's not pretty. Yeah. Then However, we in the out. midst of all of this, one single blista eventually manages to shoot in the middle of you and explodes in icy explosion. Hitting all of you. Uh, give me a reflex. Oh, fuck. Reflex. 31 with a nat 20 um slay bell takes 20 damage warden okay. you 10 damage and jithar you take nothing let me just look at him like they're stupid takes 5 and in the aftermath of this explosion, you see that this was also friendly fire. All of the elves are just lying on the ground. Oh, wow. Okay. We're running. Let's go out. Yeah. They're bleeding out. Um, you see that a heavily bloodied bee steps off from the shield and starts slashing around, also clear, trying to clear a path together with Jithar. <laughs> Uh, and you eventually do manage to get through. Uh, I suppose you all fly through the hole. Oh, yeah. Yes. That was made that pretty good. Jethar, yeah, yeah. Jethar just jumps through the goddamn hole, dives through it. Yeah, meanwhile, uh, you see the beat does, as she slices one of these elves uh, that's uh, on the ground bleeding out, she just cuts, slices his throat and takes its scimitar and starts dashing towards another one, slicing that one, grabbing its scimitar, jewel wielding just like Slay Bell and just dashing behind I'll you too. yell back to her It's open! Go! Can Warden yoink one of the scimitars from someone's hand? Uh, you can definitely as uh, Jithar is just slashing Slay Bells right behind him, also slashing and killing off whatever Jithar didn't kill and B also you can definitely pick up a scimitar as you run. And I will say that you all managed to escape <sighs> the fort that is Klaus's home. Nice. Woo! However, there is bonus content if you guys want. <laughs> there is bonus. We're, we have to run for our lives here. We're still just barely outside the fort. <laughs> but I'm guessing that uh, that there is more outside of just running for our lives. Yes. 
All right. I'm I'm down for bonus content. You guys? Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah. Did I, you all manage to uh oh, sorry, Chris? I was gonna say I might need to excuse myself in a bit. But, yeah. Um, um bonus oh, content. Okay. I will I will say that um as you all managed to run out you passed over the bridge, dodge the catapults there, the blisters, and uh managed to escape together with B and uh, after a long while of running you think that you're probably safe you're on the white steps uh, probably two three miles away from the fort now it was quite a run you had your all exhausted just from the straight running but you think you can catch your breath here for a while you don't see anything anyone right behind you right now and uh, i think we can take like a five or ten minute break good I need to catch your breath i'm not the only one who has to excuse themselves here but i was riveted <laughs> i'm gonna rush off i'll be back Same. Right. be right back you're back